time it is. Let me get these drops out the way. God damn it, we got some talking to do. No, 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 Joe Biden. No, 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 Microphone check, one, two, what is this? Welcome to the Joe Button Podcast episode. Come on, give it to me. Give... You fuck 256. Yeah. Damn, so we've, been, we going? we've been going a while. Wow, now this is what I call music 56. Six. This Whoa. is 256. What are the yeah. fucking chances? Some things aren't a coincidence, Parks. Mm. What are the chances? Every 11-11, I just ask them for signs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> won't, won't he do it, Maul? You was at Sunday service. <laughs> <laughs> Won't he do it more? Hey, you are hey, such a bitch. We gonna hey, get into you. Take take a look at your neighbor on the right. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey. Hug somebody that you don't know. <laughs> Boy, we really gonna get into you. Don't you worry about it. Welcome to the Joe Button Podcast, episode 256. I'm your humble, gracious, and grateful host, Joe Button, here with a few of my mm. nearest and dearest friends. Uh, did you did you go through a name transition while you were there? <laughs> what's your, are, what's are your you, brother Maul? What's your confirmation you, name? Are you Maul still? My name is Rashid Sunflower. Mo, there, there we go. Uh, my guy Rashid Sunflower is here. <laughs> for Wait, is there a meaning by the sunflower? Like, tell us your journey. It was just a lot of sunflowers in the grass, so we just okay. went with that. Rashid Sunflower. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I want to hate. No, but yeah, but no, I like it. no, no, it's here to stay. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you do like it. Rashid, <laughs> no, let me check. Where's my phone, man? Let me change his contact name. Uh, Rashid Sunflower is here, formerly known as Molly Maul, the one and only son of Carmen. Yeah. Parks is here. Uh, Rory is here. Irish McNasty. Somehow Rory is, is here, but he's hosting a party. He just hosted a party. Just, just did last night in Los Angeles. In LA, man. I don't know how you do it, man. Listen, man. That's better. Never not working. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Booked and busy. My guy. You know what it is. Mm, you're not the only one. I like it. I see some other people out there booked and busy. <laughs> uh, my guy, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I'm trying to introduce Erickson. <laughs> Erickson is here. Erickson has been here. <laughs> and, he, got, he got his knees and, out. He and, got his knees out. <laughs> he did that shit himself. <laughs> He put that paint there too. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh, I used to want to do that when, when I couldn't afford like the cool clothes. Like mm. my mom, you try to make me spice it up on my own. It never turned out right. No, no it never does. Uh, shout out there. Look, he put a little pink pink flare on the Woo! marker. I like it. Those are good jeans. <laughs> a little bit. And last and least, my guy, Savon. <laughs> Savon the last dude. Last and leastly. <laughs> yeah, word. If there was something after least, I would put it. Everybody is here. Eight minutes in. Everybody is here. Fresh back from vacation. Uh, shout out to you people that missed us, first and foremost. Uh, the man, y'all were annoying. <laughs> why, couldn't yeah. I, why couldn't I just sit at home and chill? Uh, they nah, to, they ain't no chill. We had to feel this, their loss. Ain't no and, chill. And, and what, else, what else I thought about when, when, when it was time to actually come back to work, which I don't really view this as work, but when it was time to come back to potting, I said, well, technically... We shouldn't be trusted to deliver a dope pod fresh off vacation because yeah. we really shouldn't have shit to talk about. <laughs> we shouldn't know nothing. If we had a successful vacation, we shouldn't know nothing about nothing. And also, everyone that goes on vacation that works, that first Monday you back, like it's you're, not, you're not really back. You still tan. Yeah. Yeah, you still like kind of yeah. dressing in your vacation swag. You're it's just true. telling everyone about the vacay. You're not really working. Yeah. yeah. Maybe yeah. maybe next Wednesday we'll get back to it. <laughs> uh, but just like we called, we said we would go away and everything would happen. So the first second we take a break, <laughs> Joe Biden decides to stand with segregationists on Juneteenth. And OJ comes to Twitter to say, let's talk about it. <laughs> That's what happened while we were gone. The world, and the world has changed so much. It was a lot of, it was for real. Yeah. Hey, we went on. We were going away to vacation while I was pondering canceling a DR trip because there was too much death and danger. Here we are back, the same way we left. More death and danger this in morning. DR. Yeah, this morning. Uh, they're saying this is an alcohol, uh, alcohol thing. Yeah, and well, a, lot, a lot of them have been that. Which yeah. you might as well say it's bre- it's, that's, You might as well say it's an air thing. 
word. Yeah. <laughs> vacation and alcohol yeah. is like breathing. You, vacation I'm, on the beach? Yeah. Yeah. I'm hitting the mini bar. Well, no, the, the mini I'm bar. I'm drinking. I'm the drinking. Mini, the yeah. mini bar is very specific. Yeah. You have to know what type of mood and swag you in when you go after the mini bar. It's not early in the day. You got the bar downstairs for that. Oh, yeah. It's when you come back. See? And you're a little buzzed and you may have something with you. But, yeah. and, and you don't want to then take her down to the bar. No. Like, yo, no, nah, I, got, I got wine up in the room. Well, that's why I'm about, I was about to cut you, you off. Said, <laughs> Rory said you got something with you like you didn't take the trip with her. But <laughs> no, no. You, what? you go on vacation. Right. You can find something in Dior. You go on vacation by yourself? I with your friends. I, more, I don't do the seven people in one room thing. Oh, no. no so I'll be by that. myself and maybe your vacation, find a patron you, on, uh, you on are, vacation as you well. You are vacationing either entirely too wrong or entirely too right if you never hit the minibar. <laughs> Correct. It's one of the that other. made mad sense. Correct. Yeah, like yeah. what a what a what type of loser are you <laughs> that just knew every time in advance when you would be parched or wanted to get drunk or like yeah. Why are you planning for that on vacation? No, hit the mini bar. Yeah. Hey, when all that shit closed, when you hit the fucking Spanish nigga and he said no, Papi, eleven, no, done, no, yeah. finish. Hit the mini bar. Sometimes you go on vacation with a girl, and that's the only time that your girl is going to get into some. Freaky diggy shit. You might bring somebody else through and ask company in the room. You got to mm. hit the mini bar. Yeah. Mm. I can think of a million instances. We just hit the mini bar. Now you got to die. <laughs> now you got to die. <laughs> I, was I, mean, just, just, laugh, I was but. just trying to get a lap dance. Yeah. And that, that little absolute for $17 would have popped it off. Uh, but I don't want to start. I don't, didn't want to start with DR. I was just saying the same way we left is the same way we returned. Uh, a lot to get into, though. So where would you guys like to start? Are we starting with malls brainwashing at Kanye's? Tell me about your vacation, gentlemen. We had 11 minutes in, but I'm down to hear about what y'all have been up to. I knew this would be a good pod because every time we don't talk to each other, it's a good pod. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I went to Miami. Give me stuff to laugh about, you guys. Okay. <laughs> I went to Miami. That's funny. La- so. Last minute decision. That's funny that Parks went to Miami. Yeah. Tell me more. Uh, ran into save on the dawn while ran, I was out there. Ran into, yeah. ran into okay. Can ran I ask? Into. Can I ask whereabouts in the city Miami limits? And how fast were y'all running? <laughs> when, y'all ran into, <laughs> when you ran into each other, uh, it was a slow walk. Actually, I, I ran into him twice. The first time he igged me. Did uh did Savon have on a sleeveless shirt? Uh, I believe he did, and a bucket hat. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas hate how Joe dressed till Joe ain't around him dressing. <laughs> What? what does that even mean? <laughs> it means Savon got a lot of jokes too. I ain't around with my bucket. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, he wore. Now he, wore, he in a bucket. He wore a bucket out in the rain. Bucket low, like fuck it though. No, the man. fuck out of here. <laughs> anyway, okay. And then we hit Wood Tavern later on in the evening, and I said, Savon, I think I saw you on Lincoln. And he was like, That was me on Lincoln. I was with my girl, so I'm yelling at uh, who I thought was a stranger, but mm-hmm. I thought it was Savon. My girl's like, I don't think that's Savon. He's not answering. I was going to chase him down. And it turns out it was Savon. All right. En- so, uh, en- enough all right. about that. Savon, did you have sex in Miami or not? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't ask you if you were chilling. I he just you answered you. you. Anytime Miami, a man so says, I was chilling. Yeah. At he all. just said he was chilling. Did you get a hand? He just answered. Did a woman touch you in a sensitive area that's not normally touched? Do that's we still the have best. the, uh, he lied? That is awesome. The- <laughs> <laughs> when a chick hits you in the spot, whoa. <laughs> whoa. How you knew to hit right there? Uh, I think we do. Let's see. He lied. Y'all niggas worship him. All right, I don't care enough about Savon. Ma. <laughs> Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? How you feeling? First of all, right? I'm sorry. Rashid. M- Mr. Uh, Brother Flowers. Yes. <laughs> Sunflowers. I'm Come sorry. on, give it to me, Ma. Just what? give it man, to me. We, we have spoke, a lot to talk about, and I'm not giving you the five-hour podcast. We spoke about this, man. What do you want, man? Do, it's no, not no, a no, fucking ba- cult. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a cult. That's what someone in the cult would say. Mm-hmm. Time out. But, but, but time out. Let's just give background to the people that... Oh shit! Wait. Uh, no, they saw it. Shout out to the Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> shout out to the Spotify listenership. Shout out to our YouTube viewership. Shout out to uh, just shout out to everybody, man. Shout out to everybody who is harmonious in your enjoyment of the show. Now back to Rashid Sunflower. Yo, <laughs> uh, Maul. A lot to begin with, and mm-hmm. because I have energy, let's do it. Your your name is spelled Jamil, but it's pronounced Jamal. Mm-hmm. You are a Muslim, right? No. No? My, father, my father's Muslim. Your father's Muslim. So you're not? No. Then why do you fast? Oh, uh, you could just fast for uh, so you just fast. different reasons, yeah. Okay. Well, Christians well, what fast you, too. Well, hold up. What, well, what do you subscribe to? <laughs> I believe in God. But I'm not, a, I'm not a religious, but I don't believe in religion. Religion separates people. I'm with you, Ma. I don't believe in religion. So did you wear your Jesus piece to the Sunday service? Oh, yeah. We want to know. I think it was Swinging. Swinging. <laughs> Swinging. <laughs> 
it was swinging. <laughs> Every time I think we got him. Uh, <laughs> did did it was swinging. Did Kanye, in fact, style you to enter into the Sunday service? Did you wear a robe? No. No, a rope. A robe. No, or a rope. Nobody had on robes. <laughs> you don't know fashion. That's what the ropes are in. Did, did, did you do it? No. Did, did Virgil just put something over your neck and you thought <laughs> it was ill? Did Verbal drape you? You no. had an off-white <laughs> fucking noose on. No. Everybody wore whatever they wanted to wear. Did you? Um, did he have a chair for you? Uh, there was like uh, benches around the whole. L- like room. first, like a first chair. Were you no. handcuffed to in the choir? No. <laughs> Were you handcuffed at all during the day? No. Did Kim get anybody out of handcuffs that day? I don't know what she did, but so she, she wasn't was there. there. She was chilling. Did, uh, she didn't, did, did you drink? She didn't clear. So she didn't clear your priors. So you back to your. <laughs> <laughs> did she clear some of my priors? I hope so. <laughs> like she checking any warrants you may have out there. I hope so. She can get it done. Did you drink any Kool Aid? No. Yes, you did. Do you have a trip no. planned to Guyana? Wait, hold on, no, no, no. Hold on. Let's not skip over that. Yes, you did. What Kool Aid did I drink? The grape. No. I didn't drink anything. The purple. Yeah, the purple one. Same bottle of water I walked in Ew, with. It's the same bottle I walked out with. You drink fucking Kool Aid that Kim made. <laughs> <laughs> she might make some fire Kool Aid. No, no, she got no, kids. No. Anybody with kids make fire Kool Aid. true. That is true. Yo, you can't make wet Kool Aid and have brainwashed. kids. Brainwashed. We have brainwashed. I'm not. All right, we're we not getting into that. Uh, come on, man. Tell us why were you, why were you there? I feel like now, like why are you there? Did they play outside? Well, no. Well, I went to. Uh, Did they shout me out? No. They shout you out. No. Did they do any shout outs? Uh, no. Did They're, they ask for a collection? No. It's not church. Did you throw money at anybody? No, that would have been disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been disrespectful there, no. Why is that disrespectful no, anywhere but Starlet? Exactly. <laughs> no, and there's cultures at weddings and shit, you throw money at people. Oh, then now that is true, yes. I no, but it was, it was the total opposite of anything I think we ever spoke about <laughs> or thought it was. All right, well, well the list, tell the listeners. I'm it's, intrigued to what it is. It's literally it, what, what it felt like to me was again. This is Kanye, so it was like a a, a big. Did it room. feel like a big dark twisted fantasy? <laughs> no, but it, it <laughs> was it, there a girl with wings? <laughs> no. Did you what? buy socks? Were you late no. to register <laughs> to get in? No. <laughs> <laughs> Were there any graduates there? The graduates? <laughs> yeah. Um, was it like a graduation? No. No. But you wore your Jesus piece. Jesus peace. Okay. Yes. Was anybody there heartbroken? <laughs> was Pablo there? There was an 808 there, though. Was Pablo there? <laughs> I don't there know. Had, there, was don't, don't there was definitely an 808 present. Don't fucking lie to us, Al Rashid. There was heartbreak. There was definitely heartbreak somewhere. He had a brass section, though. That was pretty dope. Hmm. Yeah. Yo. Look what impresses Maul. A brass section. Well, no, I'm in mean, a brass section, too. Yeah, no, brass section is kind of fire. Yeah. Dope. No, it is dope, but yeah. don't, don't deny being the first tenor and then say, oh, the brass, the brass section was We didn't ask him if he sang it. I didn't know. I did. I asked if they had nah, a chair Nah, you sang. Yes, no. you did. What songs you sang? You hit him with, with, with some Ain't Nobody, Shaka? No. I, I didn't you know sing. the lyrics that can't tell me nothing. You sang along. It, they didn't sing oh, that. Oh, my. Yo, fuck, fam, Maul. I will never let you on this podcast again. They didn't again. sing that. I'm not talking about what they did. If I see footage of you standing up in a robe saying, la, <laughs> nobody la, 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 la. Why do you think they have robes? That was more of an alto, to Rashid, He's a little low. Get his money right. Why do you keep saying uh, robes? Nobody had on robes. <laughs> we're, we're doing a podcast. No, I'm, I'm answering you. <laughs> we saw the video. I saw people with robes. We're, nobody had a robe on. What were the those white were, things? Those were Fox. oversized. Uh, they were wings? No, those were oversized. Uh, I think Everyone was butt ass? Like, can uh, you give us something? Yeah. Was it like total <laughs> tell? What happened? I'm, I'm trying to tell y'all. Nobody wants to let me speak. All right, all right. My bad, Rashid. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Break it it wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, it really was the total opposite from, I think, anything we've ever thought it was. Like, when it was over, I was kind of standing there like, that's am, it? Am I still Rashid? Yeah. It was, it was dope, though. <laughs> Am am I am who I am? <laughs> yeah. Is it is what it he, is to be? He who walks without sin? <laughs> he who just broke up with sin? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> was this a case of Mendeecees oh, having his cake glass. and I had, eating I had it too? I had to go get because it. when he wasn't with Yandy, was he with Eric? He wasn't with Eric. I had to clean it up. I had to clean it up. Uh, Pregnancy would have some overlap. I had to clean it up. I had to clean it up. <laughs> yeah, man, Cuba Gooding. <laughs> <laughs> Wild. Uh, all right, no. So, 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 how do we feel about this? So, so you will return. Yeah, for sure. Well, no. Honestly, tell us what happened. It's literally just a dope choir singing. 
and people just singing along if they know the words. You, you think they could fuck with the Harlem Boys? Yeah, choir? better than your choir. And I kind of no, thought what the Harlem Boys was. The, the thing with the a boys called Harlem, we didn't have like we had sopranos, Kanye. but it was younger younger boys. They had like real female sopranos, so you can't beat that. They had cute sopranos. It was some cute girls. Yeah, it was a lot of pretty mm, pretty girls. Saying. Were you flirting with anybody? No. Can't can't do that in that type of moment. What moment? Yeah, if it ain't nothing yeah, religious, it's not church. no. But it's, 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 it's singing not. songs. It's gospel, yeah, I want to brought It's still, it's still gospel that. music. It's, oh, it's yeah. like did you bring any liquor through? No. Wait, Maul told me that they redid. Uh, <laughs> they redid Prince's "I Would Die for You" and changed it to "Jesus Would Die for You." I saw you. that. Jesus. That was all. Well, first of all, church has done yeah. that mad times. They didn't invent that. They killed it though. It's a really dope choir. Like they really I'm, can well, sing. Well, listen. Really well. All jokes aside, like because we are jokes, I'm I'm certain that Kanye can pick a great choir. Of course. No, like they sounded really, yeah. really. Well, really no, good. and everything Maul told me off air. It, that's what I thought it was. Yeah. It literally, I thought it was a was, choir that was doing. There wasn't a church single... songs and then mixing in Kanye. Songs. Yeah. Why are you telling us that we thought it was something different? I, f- I feel like through our conversation, we definitely thought it was something I different. I feel like they're brainwashing people and you do that through music. So you coming to tell me that no, they're, they're playing music don't really change my mind about it. No, anything. it wasn't brain because there's literally nobody. I'll play the music from all the uh, black uh, black shit over here. My white wife will go and do all this over here and whatever's happening. Yeah. No, it's literally yeah. just gospel music. It's a young choir out of LA that can sing and they just in there jamming with a organ and brass section and there's literally not a cross hanging not a picture of any spiritual figures it's literally a white room like i think kanye trying to make it feel like a a, a art gallery and that the people in it is uh, art, they, is they art. say something else about all white rooms what do they say nuthouse padded room uh calming calming it, it's uh they say all white is hypnotizing because it's all white they say all white is almost worse than it's the worst that you could possibly be in because there's no color. So if you stare at it long enough, well, that's I think the room being all white and then the people that. Are Why do in the I room, know that? <laughs> you do. You well, do you have, have, a, you have album. an album called Padded yeah. Room. That, what the fuck that mean? I did research on my album title. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think uh, thirty years prior. <laughs> Thank you, Rory. Yeah, but I just think it's. I think he's just trying to connect, you know, to the younger people, to the younger generation. He's doing it through young through people so love choirs. Yeah, it's um, dope though. So and I'm, it's not, really dope. I'm not mad at that. I'm I, I like it was like a whole mix of whole bunch of different people from different walks of life, different races, and it was just dope. It was dope to see all this of that. This wasn't the room. outside shit in the grass. No, I think they stopped doing that. Oh, I think okay. this is probably going to be their location from now oh, okay. inside. Uh, outside, I think he was trying to figure it out still mm-hmm. until they found a place. I think this is going to be the place though. Listen, but it was dope, listen, though. listen, listen. This is the rapid fire podcast. <laughs> let me let me start there. This is the rapid, welcome to our first rapid fire podcast. <laughs> Never before has there been 90 million topics for us to just breeze through because we've gone away. So I, all of my opinions, I'm giving like mall today. Just so we can get through it without having to be here for five hours. No. I don't care enough about this church shit to start there for 10 it's minutes. It's not church. I don't. There's, there's right, no preaching. Right, there's no Bible. Whatever's, there's no, whatever's in there, I don't give a fuck about none of it. To keep talking about it, but I do want to go if it's cool. <laughs> it's cool. You would like it. It's yeah. just music. Yeah, one okay. day. It's music when they do a live stream. I'll pay for it. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. <laughs> um, where where do we where do we begin with well, all you, of this madness? Twenty. You skipped over in? your vacation, but yeah, here or there. Well, because my I didn't I didn't really do I didn't do very much. Mm. I didn't. <laughs> Niggas never do much, like, right? You know I mean? no. When they do the most, <laughs> yeah, no, they ain't I ain't do it. much. You know? I only slept three hours in five days. Be- Be- Beans said, "I don't do much." Yeah, you're right. He did say that. I didn't do Beans too was, much. Beans was doing a lot. Yeah, he did. I was <laughs> clearly yeah, when he said that, especially when he <laughs> yes, said that. When, doing <laughs> yeah, the most. when he wrote that, he was doing maximum. <laughs> I went. I went. Uh, we didn't go to DR because uh, life. So last minute trip to Miami. Uh, stayed at. Uh, uh, we were there during the film festival, so I was trying not to really be out oh, yeah. very much. That. I didn't yeah. see uh, so I stayed I stayed in the room. Had a chef come over. She she chefed something up. She was great. I need to text her. Um ate the leftovers the next day. I, I didn't do much. One night I was just tired of being in, so I tried to go out and and I quickly learned that I'm just Miami nightlife is it's not uh it's, Miami it's not nightlife. for me anymore. <laughs> yeah. It's not for me. That that I'm not saying Miami Slash nightlife is bad for me. I'm saying the two combined. Like I was telling you, like I you almost got to treat it like LA now. Like like when you go to LA, you know, it's a, you got to know where the kickback is. 
You got to know who's doing what. You got to kind of know what's happening. I feel like that's the case with Miami now. I'm not just going making a cameo at cameo. You should you should have pulled up. <laughs> to I think Wood Miami's Tavern. probably worse. I'm not going to Wood Tavern. That shit was lit. Every and and for some reason I'm like really famous in Miami. Mm. Or sin is somebody is. <laughs> but it, it's annoying to walk the street. I tell you that. Uh. Like niggas are just screaming at me. I'm just trying to walk, fam. <laughs> well, everyone there is from here. Well, well, not everyone, but a lot of people. Listen, I had a good time in Miami. It was a quick, quick three, four days. I, I came back and spent the last week of the vacation at home. And boy, did I have a blast. Nice. Super, super, super fun. Well rested, relaxed, relaxing, fun. tranquil, uh, serene, all that good shit. Did you get in the pool? No, 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 I ain't getting in the pool. <laughs> nah, listen, if I get in the pool, it's trouble, man. <laughs> get in the pool. When a nigga can't swim. In what type of way? When a nigga can't swim, get in the pool. Like, you you on, have man. a shallow one. Huh? You have a shallow one. You have a kiddie pool? I was on a shallow one when I almost killed myself. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right. I was going to laugh when I said I almost killed myself. <laughs> yeah. It's like a real story, too. Dying on the shallow end of the water. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hilarious. Stand up. Hilarious about me. <laughs> <laughs> stand up, Joe. Yeah. That's, all, that's all you got to do is just stand up. But I was standing. Okay. But how did your head... Someone <laughs> splashed you too hard? <laughs> Fam, we're not. <laughs> yo, there, there is so much to talk about. I mean, y'all There's so much to unpack. <laughs> that's, that's Joe's favorite. There's so much to unpack. So, OJ. <laughs> There's so the much Twitter. to unpack. There's, There's so much to unpack. You don't unpack shit. No, it's really. Like, it's my bags right there. there. Mo, Mo His bags are packed. Mo leave it packed. Yeah, yeah word. Yeah. Uh, no, what do y'all want to start? Honestly, y'all want to start with uh, Drake. Okay. Okay. Start the two pack. The two okay. pack. Two pack Shakur. <laughs> let's start. Let's just start with music. Yeah, let's, okay. There's a lot of music. Actually, let's not start with Drake. Let's start with Ross. Come on, Maul. Give it to me. Honestly. Yep. I didn't listen yet. Oh my fucking god. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't listen yet. Uh, last it, night I was doing too much shit. And come on. I, I didn't yo. listen yet. I slept the whole much. flight. Yeah. It's one song. I know, but I I, I didn't listen yet. I honestly didn't. He had a lot of calls on the way from the airport. Has anybody here heard the song? Yes, I've heard the song. I've, I've heard the record. Yeah. Is anybody here ready to unpack this? I like let's, the song. Fresh, let's unpack fresh it. off a of vacation. I like it. the song, actually. It's, uh, it's Safe Ross. It's the trap shit that works for his singles. I like luxury rap Ross. Me so too. I, I wait for the album when it comes to Ross singles. That's not what I'm looking for. This is one of my, like, as far as his trap joints, though, I usually don't really love them that much. But this one I actually like. I can't really say for any particular reason, but I enjoyed it. Joe, you seem displeased. Yeah, break it down, unpack it. I'm gonna start. I'll start with love. I'll start with no, not love. I'll start with, and this is one of the things. As someone who hates the the music business, this I hate when I have to admit these times. But in this instance, I really hate when like the label appears to be right. That's what I want to start with. Okay. And I say that because we're of the belief that this Ross album has been done for a while. Yeah. Yeah. I don't believe that this record is old, though. I didn't say that. But we are of the belief that he was, he, this record's been done, or at least yeah. somebody thought it was done. And I tried. don't know if it's done done, actually. At some point, somebody thought that album was done enough to start putting records out. Okay. I'm not saying done, done. You could go change whatever, especially today. Right. But he thought he was close enough to do some shit, is what I'm saying. Him. Right. He or somebody from that camp has been teasing a Port of Miami 2 for months and months. We have been talking about this since the winter, so come on. That's yeah. a right? fact. Mm -hmm. And I like that Green Gucci suit record. Mm -hmm. I did. I mean, maybe I shouldn't have, but I did. <laughs> but it didn't work. It didn't get any traction. It didn't get people talking. It didn't get nothing. It just had more questions coming uh, and it, if I remember correctly this is the same boat that I think Ross was in the previous two albums as far as searching for singles and putting them out to get his album out Right. Ross is an album artist that, that's Correct. what I'm saying it's not 2000 so I'm looking forward to the album from Ross and I think that Ross's <laughs> album because he's an album artist is going to be amazing but that green Gucci suit Coupled with this record featuring Wale, I feel like the last couple albums he's tried the trap single first. So, so here's why I think you're wrong in saying that the label might be right here. Because if I'm working Ross's album or the rollout for it, I think Ross is past the chasing a single part of his career. Shit, <laughs> it's not Ross 2010 to 2014. Ross doesn't need a single. He does not. 
put out the album Rather You Than Me you can say the numbers were much lower than they had been right, at the stop. peak of his career stop wait what time there was no single on that that album did great I just the perception throw, was amazing I just want to throw something in so y'all can I'm fo- focused on the album like when I saw that him put up that artwork I was thinking that's smart the label should just put the album out I don't, fuck a single I, I thought I, it was the album I don't, yeah. I don't I want us to argue barbershop facts because I agree with what y'all are saying but that's not true that Ross doesn't need a single? Ross is, whatever label Ross is signed to, Ross does not have the accolades to go in there like the guy that don't need a single. We're saying why, that. Why as, doesn't he? Because he don't. I mean, he don't. any that's major. A, that's a fact. All right. That's all right. a fact. Okay, then let me, let, me, argue let me reword it then. Have, let have me you seen his accolades? Any major label is going to want a single, though. For the let me part. reword it. Where Ross is at in his career, it would behoove his fan base and some shit that would really make some traction to just put out that album with some great features and some great music as a collective, rather than try to chase with that this trap sound. That's not really what's hot right you're, now. You're as skip, far as you're skipping, skipping these two thing. records when that album comes out, I don't you're, know that. Well, I don't right. think Green Gucci Two is gonna be on it. I think obviously this will be on it. I'm, I'm I'm not gonna skip this. And that's to my point. My point is, I hate when the label was right. And I'm no, I think they're and wrong in how they're packaging the shit. I think you should just go out with a Ross album. I think build hype around an album date. Well, that's and just what I put thought was happening last night. I thought, I, or the other yeah. day. I thought and they I were thought just putting the album out. I, yeah. I said, oh, great. That's the best thing to do, especially when you don't have a single. I thought yeah. Album. And, and, then, and then I stayed up. I was waiting up. Yeah, so that's why I'm saying the label is wrong. <laughs> well, I think the answer is They probably should just put the album out. It's Ross. He makes albums. I think His discography is flawless. The label has to get their money back. I think the answer is somewhere in between. You think Ross spends that much money on uh, albums right now, today? Yes. Yeah. Today? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't think so. He does. I think. I don't think so. I think he does. The, no, I don't think so. I don't not think today. so. Well, not what's even, not right. even remotely here's why close. I don't. Here's well, why it's so much money. I don't think. I don't think that. I don't think that the single shit to me is you like. You think Ross spends over a million dollars on produ- making an album? Um. No, I don't think so. I don't think so at all. I had to think about it, but no, I don't think so. I think no, he's at half. Then. Not a million dollars, no. To make, I'm just talking about making it, not rolling it out, not videos, just just making the album. The music, but, but that paid. is making. No, See, the and, music. That's, and that's why. I add, I, no, I'm adding to j- just the portion of getting this album out. Fuck a single. Let's just put an album out. How much will it cost me? Oh, I don't know. Maybe not. You might be yeah. right. You might be right. I think it's under five hundred thousand. Okay, you might be right. Now, videos are now. Right. Included, throw but. throw. What, what let's the, get there. What the label says is making the album is the videos too. Is all of that shit. And when you do that, okay. I, I think he's over a million. And when you spend over a million. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hear, I hear think his out. label expects him to sell something. And I didn't want to leave with this. I didn't even know he was getting into this, this debate. Hear me out then. If if you put five hundred thousand to a budget and he doesn't even spend that to just put out put out the album. Let's go with the old Ross strategy. Let's just see what connects. Cause even those B side luxury introspective Ross joints hit the most. Let's see what hits. Then let's put two hundred thousand aside for videos, roll out, let's get behind the record. Like, you need to move with Ross on how his career is at, not the same traditional shit that he had in 2012 when he was on top. Yeah, like, you, Rory. That's, as, that's why I'm saying the label's wrong. That's as, not how I would work a Ross album. As, as I think you someone, could do it. As ahead. someone, I'm sorry, Parks, yeah. as someone who has worked at labels, play the label game with me right now. What, if you were Ross's label, would mm-hmm. you be happy with in, in him selling, in, in the return today? Because I'm only asking because you just said... You know, they're doing it wrong. You got to treat Ross like today. So if mm-hmm. you if you were in that position, what does he need to bring back today? Album goes out. Give That's me first, first week first week, and t- first week and totality. Give it to me. Uh, First week, 75. Find out what he did last time. Uh, it was 50-something, I think. 75, I would like for him to take back in an in a ideal world, in a realistic ideal world. Uh, I think that's asking for a lot. 75 is not easy. No, it's not easy. 75 ain't easy. It's not easy at all. 75 ain't easy. But I think think Ross was capable of doing that, though. I think he's capable. For me, I feel like the better rollout for Ross would be to come... Do the single is fine, but there's no such thing as an artist do, being capable of, of 75 alone. Do do like one of the luxury like records, that. or do one of the records like the record you was talking about the Purdue uh, about um the the Cash Money guys last time. You know, like lead with that instead of leading with the, the I, I, cliche. I agree. That's thing. what I'm saying. Probably. I agree yeah. with you. Yeah, get, I agree. Get with that. like to the old him and Neo. Not saying to use Neo, but the him and Neo days. Those records, right? In this era, still last than chasing the trap sound that may be a bit dated. Right. In what today's climate is. What I mean is I don't think Ross uh, Maul can just roll out of bed and do 75 anymore. I'm not sure. I take some work. 
That's, that's, Seven, 75 is not easy. Yeah. That's what that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I, I, don't, I don't think it's a, a given. I think you still need your you still need support from your people or huh? He did 70 last uh, that's, time. That's, that's what I thought. I thought he did about 70 last time because that was impressive. Because I thought I felt like he did that on his own merit, on his own back. No no support. Nobody did shit. I feel like I feel like he can do that easily now because it's been <laughs> he it's didn't been really three have three years since he had one at all. That's yeah, all but Ross doesn't need singles. That's a, that's why I don't even understand. I'm, like we don't even my point, I, you yeah. put an album out and you let people dictate what the single is. Like the, if I'm putting out rather you you than me, you put that out. Obviously, you had some buzz from the Birdman diss and all that. Like, the, the, but that was the day before the album. All right. Santorini and Greece caught. Like, mm-hmm. all right, let me put some money behind this. Let me shoot a really nice video over there. Like, it could be very simple with Ross. They're trying to make it difficult with chasing a single. And waiting yeah. to put that shit out. I just think I he's past the al- that part of I his career. I thought the career. album was coming at midnight. <laughs> so did I. Like I'm not going to lie. Finally when, they I, got when, it right. I, when I heard it was just a record, that's why I really didn't rush to listen to it. Because I'm like, oh, it's just, it's just a single. Like, I, yeah. I'll hear it, but I didn't rush to hear it. Now, if it was the album, I would have locked in. Like, y'all know that's the album I'm waiting on. But mm-hmm. to me... And let me... I'm sorry. And not, not, just to clarify myself, I don't think that Ross is dependent on music or music money. Oh no! No, so, I think that. he just enjoys I know, making but music. I've <laughs> argued some shit earlier, so I want to double back. I don't believe that. <laughs> this is just his passion. This is what he loves. He loves to rap. And, and if he, and if I if I go by that snippet, I that don't I think heard, none of these niggas is so relying on music. But we're gonna get into that as we continue. Relying, to t- you shouldn't just rely on shit, music. No. In this day and age, yeah, yeah, no, you shouldn't rely on it. But if it's something that you love, it's your first love. You shouldn't rely it's your on passion. Your, you shouldn't rely on your career, huh? <laughs> No, no that, that's see, we not, shouldn't normalize that. that I'm, I'm, I'm no, no, no. not normalizing no, that. No, but, 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 career, right. but career, but career as an artist, as a businessman, entrepreneur, like it, it changes. Yeah, and we're not normalizing something. Just like, he's when, not just when a rapper. So many he's a, he's of an entrepreneur. He, he owns businesses. He, that's why. Got it. He has investments. He has, you know, I mean, like that's what I mean by his career. His career is being an entrepreneur. He's yeah, fucking. He's, 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 he's headlining. He's, he's headlining. Do say Palooza tomorrow. Right. Come on. Today. 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 Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. You're not even here. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. It's like Don't even ho- ask me how hologram Roy. Yeah. <laughs> Who is the complexion of a hologram? Yeah. Yeah. Wow, it's weird. Yeah. You can see through me. <laughs> um. All right. So who else? Wait, listen, man, music to get to. Oh well, Drake. Uh, I fucked. Are we getting with right to Drake? Mexico? I mean, we're on music. Well, I did like the Rick Ross verse on that song. I, think, I like. I think Ross Joe and I that. briefly spoke about that record. Uh, I think that one's gonna take. It'd be a slow burn on that one. Yeah. But I, not, but I like it I don't expect um, either of the songs to be hits That record is hard um, I like it Both of those records is hard I just think it's gonna be a slow burn with those uh, I think Omerta is Come on it's, That's the type of Drake we love So yeah. Yeah, that's There's a not much code, to say though. about that one You give Drake a beat like that And say okay <laughs> No hook Just go yeah, like, just Come go. on man like, What yeah. type of fucking cheat code is this yeah. but, but I mean he we'll, killed we'll that We'll always love that, that Yeah Drake. I'm, not, I'm never complaining about that There's not much to say there but that that Ross that 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 Ross and uh, Drake record is hard. It is. I, I don't think like it's, I just think it's gonna be a slow burn. That's all. Yeah, which is fine. Uh, slow burn's on a disc. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Drake got very disrespectful on this record too. By the way, he dissed Joe like six times. <laughs> that was a bar. Yeah. Now nah, he killed this. I always do that. Uh, I'm not rolling with y'all with this. I'm not. I'm not rolling with y'all with the, um, that other shit y'all talking about. That Ross record. You don't like the Ross record? The Drake and Ross record? You fucking crazy. I am. I like is, the Ross verse. That yeah. record is hard. That whole yeah. record is hard. Yeah, the record's hard. Yeah, I like it, but I like the Ross verse especially. Uh, if if I'm going with their history, is a difference of opinion allowed here? Yeah, of course. Okay, All right. yeah. just asking. But you've been wrong before. You'll be wrong if, again. If we're going by their history, Definitely. it doesn't isn't high on their history. But I do like the record. Yeah, it's definitely probably the lower uh, of their I flags. I fucking hate you guys. Because when, we like, of, when no, we like no, records? No, because none of us here feel like, you know, how we all feel about Drake and Ross. Like, they're going to go in and make some complete trash. None of us here think that. So for y'all to come in and say, I like it. It's good. Yeah, it's cool. But let's talk about it in regards to what they have done and what they have given us. Not it's the worst one. It's way. Like, why y'all always force me to be the bad guy for saying just simple shit? This is not just the worst collab they've done. It's like by far the worst collab. Yeah, but Joe, this is this is obviously a record that was done and they just put it out. This why? is not an album record. This is not an album cut. This is not. This isn't Dice Pineapple. This is not supposed to be Dice Pineapple. Small. Surprise, surprise. New Joe, 
I, I think I'm done judging all the music, honestly. Honestly. Okay, but well, we got to talk about it. Look what we a got... vacation will do. <laughs> no, because, listen, um, we on vacation. Listen, what's the stream? <laughs> yeah. 30 seconds. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying you can't you, you you saying this is their worst collab. Like I'm I saying, wasn't I'm look- not mad at none of these niggas for not putting their best foot forward in music no more. I'm not mad at none of them microwaving. I'm not mad at whatever it is, however it is you going about it. Whether you're chasing a single, whether you're doing the uh uh we only getting paid for 30 seconds, so I'm only making 90 second joints, you putting out EP, what how, however you want to do it, nobody's eating for music. So why am I judging it? I know what y'all are doing. And we're going to get into that the second we continue to talk about music. The next person we talk about is Nicki. Hmm. Okay. Megatron. Great. Awesome. She's doing what they all are doing. The song is just the commercial for the move. Whatever the move is. So I'm not mad at Drake and getting with Roy. Throw some shit in his B real quick, nigga. Hey, we won a championship. Let me come talk over here real quick. We put this out. That murder shit is crazy. <laughs> I think that's those records is crazy. I don't think either of them are particularly crazy. I like them both. I, think, I don't think either. I mean, of them well, are. I, I I was out in the club when both of those records came. They played on it in the club last night. Yeah, listen, oh, okay. I can't listen to no record where a dude say that when he's bored, he sit at home and sip wine and think about all of your all of his enemies' houses being foreclosed on and then going to the auction. I like that. And out <laughs> and, and outbidding everyone yeah, at I the like auction. That. Petty King. And and then going in there and auctioning off all of your belongings. <laughs> There's never a time where I'm gonna hear a rapper say that and say, uh, oh, that's just all right. <laughs> I I appreciate I like that I like that Aubrey comes from just that I swear he reminds me of Hove when he does that. It's it's slick talk. They have a very it's stunt, it's stunt talk. Yeah, it's stunt talk. He he's basically saying, "Look, you niggas is gonna go broke soon, and I'm gonna buy all of your shit because I'm not going." I'm broke so glad soon. he shitted on Benny Hannes. I hate Benny Hannes. <laughs> I saw a lot, nah, of, but he I saw up. a he, lot of people disappointed, and even nah. though Drake is full of shit, because you ain't gonna. Why you gotta fight with me at cheesecake? And then shit on uh Benny. I'm not doing that. But <laughs> yeah, I like cheesecake. And Benny no, Hannes. cheesecake is dope. No, I Drake would take cheesecake over Benny Hanna. No, Drake like cheesecake. He said, "You know, I love to go there." Like, no, yeah, I'm but, with him yeah, this but time. Don't call Benny Hanna's pigeon food. No, <laughs> and you love to go to cheese. No, nigga. I get it. I get it. I, no, I understand that. But to me, I'm more upset because now it's like, damn, we, I can't even get the Benny Hanna's date off no more. Fam, that date has been over. No Nobody way. told y'all in New York. No, that date. You still been pulling that, that date off? is like no. The, I don't really catching trip. No, you're honestly, I never you're really. Only the, the drug dealer niggas. Still no, do honestly, it. I never even really <laughs> liked Benihana's. Honestly, because that, that's yeah. their meetup spot. The, the last time no. I was at Benihana's, I was definitely seated across from a drug dealer. It's, I, it's, I, was I promise you, I never really liked Benihana because you smell like the food as soon as you walk out. Like that's the reason I never went there. Don't promise me anything. So you like kibachi in general? No, 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 no. Nah, don't 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 fry my food. In Fam, front of that Benny Hanna date is this. You know, it's, come it on, it's like the Olive Garden date. Yeah, but a few, a few chicks still want <laughs> that. They're doing actually a really good twelve ninety nine. Grab one, get one free. <laughs> never mind. Who, Olive Garden? Yeah, right oh, now. Yeah, Ooh, let's go get yeah. some breadsticks. No. <laughs> I yeah, I never like Benny Hanna's because I don't want to have to wait for seven more people to decide to come and eat before you can. I can eat. Yeah. Like they're like, yeah, we need four more people to come here and sit down. I'm like, so I'm yeah. just sitting here waiting for four random. And then there's random. some special order where Man. someone's allergic to peanuts, and you yeah. gotta like sit on this side. Yeah, yeah I'm I don't like, like <laughs> I don't like Benny Hanna because I can cook. Like it's not so fancy <laughs> watching you flip it up and down. You gotta press it. Ooh, it's gonna turn brown. All right, I'm hungry. You don't want a nigga. <laughs> you don't want a nigga take your fried rice and make it a heart. No, I, 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 I'm, I'm here. To, I, <laughs> they always do that. Yeah, I've never seen a Joe Burger in a in a heart shape. Yo, I tell you, I be wanting to punch he the Johnny the, Rockets nigga in the face for making the fight. Man, if you don't get the fuck off the fucking ketchup. He put the spat. He put the he put the spatula under the rice and start tapping that shit like a heartbeat. <laughs> Yo, fam, put my rice in my, on my plate. Yo, I'm starving. Yeah, I'm you hungry, making faces nigga. with food. Yeah, yeah. And first of all, that onion does not look like a train at all. I don't know what you're that doing. That onion and don't make a uh, don't make an onion volcano in front of me. It doesn't look oh, like oh the onion, but with the smoke. Yeah, man. now I yeah, yeah, now I smell it. like an onion volcano. Like <laughs> exactly, exactly. I don't even want to go out with the girl that is hype about the onion about volcano. The- it's over, Mo. I know you don't no, know, but I know it is it, over. I know it's over. I'm but glad now, Drake said it. Now, now it's now really you know. over. Now it's really over. Like, no, it ain't. These fucking peasants is going to be right back. Nah, hey, can I get the onion volcano? Nah, First of all, I'm, well, it's not all the way over with everything Drake said. I would love to say at the Intercontinental and the Double Tree. So I don't, I don't know what the, the fuck he was talking about. Yeah. Wait, he shit on it, don't Both of them. <laughs> what is that? The Double Tree has the best cookies. 
So I don't, I don't care what Drake talking about. He, I think he was dissing Tory. Oh. Uh, you stay at the Double Tree or some shit. No, they're friends now. I know. So, all right, so we could all stay in Double Trees now? Yeah, it's, it's cool now. <laughs> it's now. back on. Yeah, it's cool. Oh, thank God. Back okay. at the Double Tree. Hey, Drake, I ain't going to lie to you. You got the Double Tree fucked up, homeboy. I done had, <laughs> I done had some nights. Chocolate chip cookies, man. Listen, man. <laughs> I done had some good double tree nights. That was the double and, tree and, when we had to evacuate out of uh, Boston, right? No. Oh, well, that was a good one, too. Word. That was a La Quinta. <laughs> yeah. It, it felt like a La Quinta. <laughs> Definitely listen, felt like a La Quinta. Red roof in? Did, yeah. Listen, double trees and some Sheridans. Ask about me and a few Sheridans. Oh, no, they know. <laughs> they know. First of all, and Drake, fake from Houston, he know the one across from the Galleria where everyone stay at. He know what type of time it is. <laughs> Can't shit on that one. No. Anyway, Good record that, though. With that said, that double tree right there on fucking Route Four and Fort Lee made me go bankrupt. <laughs> Who says that? Word. Like, I go Who? bankrupt at the hotel <laughs> in Jersey <laughs> when you live there. Word. This thing is crazy, man. See, listen to that. <laughs> yeah, no, we, we, we processed yeah, see, it. See, listen to what y'all just said. There is an answer. <laughs> I know the answer. Why, why, crazy. why would somebody <laughs> who that lives. lives in New Jersey? <laughs> oh no, I, I know what you was doing. <laughs> Absolutely, it's just Uh-oh, funny. That's okay, why you're crazy. All right, all right, all right, no, I'm saying. aware. Got but it. going bankrupt, it's like family. I right, relax now. Like, stay home. <laughs> but that and that's your frequent. <laughs> that's why Instagram is so funny now because girls be telling on themselves on taking pictures in the hotel and you live in that city. <laughs> oh wait, I wasn't talking about girls. Like, oh, I had beef. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. We wasn't going home. Sorry. You were just getting the cookies in the lobby. <laughs> Bolognese. <laughs> Bolognese. Yo. You didn't pronounce that I right. Had bo- Bolognese. I had bo- <laughs> At the double tree? <laughs> Bolognese? <laughs> the Bolognese. I had, I had a Bolognese. Yeah, you had bowling knees? Listen, you had bowling knees. Listen, bowling knees. <laughs> rolling too hard. Holding us down for about seven months till American Express started bugging out. <laughs> Like uh, the, the client just shows the card. Why well, I got the card? What are you talking about? Wait, you, they, you get they, mad at them? They fucked the game up when they you had to present the card. Yeah. Anyway, man. Yeah. Different uh, times. Yeah, o- where we at? OJ's on Twitter. No, 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 no. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Uh, yeah, yeah. Was there much left there? Uh, I, I like both the records. Listen, I'm, 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 I'm a dick rider. I'm gonna wait till. Mid summer to ask you about this record again. Well, hold on, hold on. He put out a whole bunch of fucking pictures saying he's in album mode. Yeah, yeah, I saw him in the pool. Sipping a spritz. Put on a whole fucking array, a gallery, if you will. Let me tell y'all. Of album mode pictures. Y'all know what I said about when 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 Aubrey and when Aubrey and Forty get to making that beat go in the water, you know what happened? Yep. Same thing when Aubrey get to showing off his stomach. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Those are one and the same. Listen, when, when, listen, <laughs> when Aubrey get to say uh, future, pass me my phone. <laughs> That's, that's, how it, that's how he sounds <laughs> Slips his shirt off The pictures are going out Drake with a wine glass Is also up there Drake when, with a wine glass picture Oh Something's fam. coming <laughs> Spritzers You, you got better, the Merlot you better, you better take care Yeah <laughs> Nah Drake with the Merlot Is crazy yeah. Fam when, Spritzers When Drake start giving nice you Nice Shiraz Yeah 90 pictures Shiraz <laughs> <laughs> A nice Shiraz <laughs> Drake, was, Drake was sipping Whispering Angel <laughs> Yeah. When Drake start giving you wine glasses and stomach, it's, it's, ha- on. it's, 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 on. it's happening. It's on. But you know what I do appreciate? Uh, like we talk about here, like just some of the some of the uh, main artists just changing when they drop and when they come in and just I, I like watching that schedule. So like we said, when Khaled dropped, everybody was going to rush out. And sure enough, yep. that's what's happening. And I knew that them niggas over there at OVO was smarter than that. Why didn't I think that they just... I don't know why I thought they would drop something to someone. I should have known they were smart. They're going to wait till all this bullshit get out the way and be right there in the winter when ain't nobody doing nothing but sitting home with their ear glued to that fucking OVO radio. When did Scorpion come out? June? Scorpion was a summertime thing. Yeah, it was yeah. Drake, <laughs> Drake might be coming right back. Yeah. Well, listen, let me tell you I can still see it like a late summer, August. Before we... Uh, yeah, putting up... Because he don't move that way where other artists just promote like, yo, it's coming shit. Yeah, the if he's saying done. album mode, he's... Yeah, the album's done. It's been... <laughs> there's yeah, a date. That's or a vacation. That's a vacation because he just wrapped the album. Yeah. Well, more importantly, our five-year anniversary is coming up. Aww. Aww. No, it's not till. No, ain't no on. Oh, this, is a, this, this is a business conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, talking about uh, This is a hey, all hands on deck. Everybody hit drink for the interview. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, I think Push ruined our, our interview. 
No, no, not, not when this was prior to us interviewing him. I just think that whole thing stopped him from coming on our podcast. Just my theory for that for that rollout. Nah, he nah. I don't think so. Because he wasn't going to do interviews after that. Nothing to do with push. This, bet, I'm talking about listen, way before push came I on our podcast. I better not see Drake with Zane Lowe. I know that much. <laughs> if I see Drake and Zane Lowe together, it's on. <laughs> it's on, honestly. Uh, what what other music is there? And yeah, February five years. I didn't know that we was uh, in action that long. It's a long time. Yeah. Well, I mean, they were, y'all was kind of. Around. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean, you know what I mean, but my, my day one, my day seven, <laughs> end of the week. Yeah. Uh, all right. What other what other music came out? Uh, Benny, Benny, be- hey Benny, I'll be Man, honest listen. with you, Benny. It's tough for me to listen to your music. It is because I'm trying to live clean. <laughs> I'm trying to live just a peaceful, legit, legal life. And your music don't come on track one with you and Black Thought. And I'm just trying to go to work. Yeah, Black, I'm headed to work. Yeah, Black Thought went crazy. So Damn, just man. when I thought that that was too crazy, here they come again. Next track, I'm trying to go to work. Podcast shit. Mm. Thirty eight special Benny and Kiss. Yeah. <laughs> Kiss talking about it's still raw. I only did the two step on it. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. I like Yo, that type of language. It's seven tracks of that. Yeah. yeah. Man, get this shit out of nah. Hey, so turn that down nah. and turn on Wall Street Journal. Nah, turn, <laughs> turn that shit up. Nah, man. Turn I almost robbed somebody yeah. on the way here. You need that almost robbing nigga music. Yeah. Yeah. In the that, summer? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's when you need it. Need it. Yeah, Hell yeah. See, that's Gotta why keep I'm, you on your toes that's out why, here. That's yeah. why I'm staying Everyone's home. Everyone's outside. <laughs> that's that's yeah. why I'm staying home. Because Benny dropped. They smoked that. Yeah, they did. They yeah, did. man. Benny, I'm, I'm, I'm happy for Benny, man. Nice little seven songs, too. It's easy. You know yeah. what I mean? You know why? And, and a, a quick follow up to. I'm still listening to Tana Talk 3. Me too. Right. <laughs> like, that hasn't left rotation yet. Word. Right. Yeah, they're putting out a lot of music fast. They do yeah. that. All of them. They yeah, work really quick. Yeah, they do. But the quality is never compromised, so I can't even knock it. Yeah. Like, it still sounds good every time. Well, th- this is why I do appreciate uh, Benny and those guys. They don't run from the niggas with bars. Word. Uh, they seek them out. They're looking <laughs> for the dudes with bars. Yeah. And it's not too many rappers I could say that about. I got to tip my hat to those guys. Like, they, they remind me of me. Mm. I used to go look for it. They look, who looks for Black Thought and Kiss? Word. The niggas that, <laughs> you know, when, when you come up studying those did you those have niggas? a long day? What, what was you even home thinking? <laughs> but when you study those type of rappers and you, you know what I mean? You, you, you spend so many years listening to them. You start to feel like I could hold my own in the same room with these guys. Yeah, so and now that I have op- yeah, so now that I have an opportunity he did. to show and prove, I'm, I'm going to do it. And you know, I yeah. still got to hear. I still got to hear them niggas. Like, what are they going to do? And I don't want to get into my critique bag, Hovain. Don't call me. Don't call me. I'm just talking. <laughs> just talking. Like, like when it comes to the rapidy rappers, I always get into well, damn, what they going to do? I want to keep hearing this. That's that's what See? I want to hear. Yeah, it's always, can, it's always a lane space I'm, and I'm be a, just fine. It's always a market for it. I'm Republican. Yeah, yeah. Been, I've been quiet, Joe. I'm never, I'm never going to expose to the world why you're Republican, <laughs> but it's cool. Yeah, yes, they can live in this space. They can tour. Their merch goes Absolutely. crazy. They are making a lot more money than signed rappers. Word. I can promise you that. Absolutely. Word. All right, wait. All right, let me clarify myself. I'm not saying they should sell out or do something different. I'm saying, rapidy rappers. When you try to figure out how to expand, it's like limited. It's like okay. only but so many ways to expand doing what you do. And they've already, like you said, the merge game out of this world. Right. I, I the nigga, nigga hit me when they performed the other night. I said, yo, the venue's getting bigger and bigger. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> like y'all, y'all doing what you got to do there. So as an artist, when you're home and you're looking at everything and things are going well by doing what you can do and you say, how do I expand? That's what I'm saying. Keep doing what you do. So it's not fear. I don't think it's fear as a fan to say, yo, they can keep doing that. Of course. We love it. Right. We love it. But there's value in consistency, though. Like, I'm just going to keep think, doing exactly what I do well. Yeah. And I think they take they take a page from the Wu-Tang book. I agree. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it's like, we're going to be who we are, do what we do, and, and introduce the world to our sound and what mm-hmm. it is that we do. And it's just going to keep growing. Yeah. Well, I, I want to see them tap. Europe and all that Because sh- Europe still listens To that grimy shit Oh mm-hmm. yeah Like 
I think that would be the next move for them. They don't even need to touch the United States. They might they have over difficulty there. doing that. I don't know what the, uh, everyone's well, status that's, that's, is. Well, that's what... Uh, well, that part. Yeah. But that's where a major label that they're signed to would come into play. Yeah, like, maybe That's so. where you should use that machine. They would kill and I'm not saying there. they're not doing that. I'm. That's where my head would be at. Let's go pop over there. They we would need, kill. You know, merch... Over, like, people buy things overseas. Yeah. We Americans don't. <laughs> they pay real money for people to come there, too. Exactly. <laughs> but I think their next move is going to help that. In America, yeah, I think so too. <laughs> yeah, they do. No, no, I mean they more. In, of course, I mean in like rap wise, it's it's tough for. I've people. toured with Prem in Europe. I know what that's like. It's like, different, right? <laughs> it's different. It's way different. It's different. My bad, Parks. Damn. No, I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I like mean, the real, real I know you know Prem, shit, money. Boom you know bap shit in <laughs> Europe is no, different. Yeah, no, they still listen. I'm saying yeah, they still no, listen. That shit, the way you know what like, we got those lyrics don't really you don't really buy. They don't sell as much out here. Is what I'm saying. But hold up for a minute. You know we got to stop. We gotta like when niggas say it's different. Like they gotta tell us why it's different. Because <laughs> it's okay, not. I understand. Okay, what I'll, I'll tell you. It's different. Because I want to know. It's not going around. It's not going around doing three hundred people venue. It's going around doing five thousand people, yeah. twenty thousand people festivals, mm-hmm. big fucking. Even if it's just a little club day, it's a fifteen hundred people club. It's mm-hmm. not just going around doing five hundred, three hundred people in you know the middle of America. Yeah. No disrespect. Right. And like all those America. those specific eras, that Europe was still. <laughs> no, I mean there's small markets over there in Europe. It's it's it's, it's different. It's, yeah. there's people bigger travel, cities closer not, together. They're not used to and that. they know you're, they're not going to always have a chance to see you. That's yeah, so like it, like the way you would out. touch on the East Coast run fucking 15 cities on your way down to Florida, it don't work that way over there. And yeah. you only do it maybe once or twice a year, maybe even once every five years. Right. So it pays different. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's one time to get all that merch. It's one time to, to sell your shit. Like they keep up with it because they don't have access to it the same way we do. And they just like that sound. They like they the still sound of that, that shit. era. Yeah. It's still prevalent. That real there. gritty hip hop. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, track three came on. I was like, "Damn, y'all giving me this snare already." <laughs> like, <laughs> I understand. I, I do. I do love how they move in the sense that everything shuts down for whoever's coming out. Yeah, like the way an old unit used to do. Uh, who else? I, good music used to do that. Like, I like crews that stop everything they're doing, no matter even if it's the biggest person on the label, smallest person on the label, middle right. it doesn't matter. We're stopping everything we're doing, and this is our focus. That's how you win. Let me jump in really quick, see, and off of what y'all are saying, this is why I think there just needs to be different categories, and every rapper shouldn't be held to how nice you are with words, because we need a list of the best rappers that make you want to rob somebody, because that's really, <laughs> that's really, really, really important. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Jim's album made me want to do that. Uh, yeah. the, uh, these niggas, Benny shit, 38 Spesh. Yeah. Uh, it's not too many of them. So, yeah. so when, I, when you hear it, it's like refreshing to me almost. Word. Like, ooh, I can rob some money now. <laughs> yeah, even, like, it's even, okay. Even, yeah. Sty- even Styles in his progressive, I'm an adult, like I'm in a really great space in my he life. He still give it to Styles me. Styles yeah. still, oh, absolutely. he still does. He put yeah. out a project too with his son. Yeah, Styles still, still give it to me. Dave East made me want to go fuck a project, bitch, that I don't have no business fucking. But but it would be fire pussy. Oh, yo, Dave songs. He always got a bitch that's like, why are you going through this with her, Dave? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's like, Dave. Yeah, Dave, fucking Dave. Fucking this bitch. I she ain't paid the rent. Like, damn. Yeah. <laughs> Dave, Dave is always leaving like an A list actress with a million dollars to go fuck a project, bitch. Yeah. But he like it better over there. And I yeah. feel him. <laughs> and I feel him. No, Dave always and I fucking. Feel him. He always fucking a hood bitch and then get surprised when she do hood shit. Like, yo, my Roly. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you mean, Dave? This bitch is from Building Three, nigga. Like you got a forty thousand dollar watch sitting right there. You think that they go grow legs, nigga? Yeah, right. That's pretty funny. Shout out to Dave. It is great. Uh, Still well, music. Uh, Dreamville put out a two pack. Yeah, I didn't hear you. Uh, it's one record with Ari, Dreezy, Ty, cuts. and Omen, and then the other one is with Cole, JID. What's Parks the group? Me out. Uh, what's the group? Earth Gang, Earth who Gang. I love, Earth and Gang. I think there's more. That's like the rapper you rap one, and the other one's the R and B joint. Yeah, one was very like boom bap. Like, I, I like I like the juxtaposition. <laughs> it. Yeah. it was good. It was Ty and Artie getting they bag. Dreezy fucking smoked that verse. Mm. Uh, Omen's Omen shit was good. I liked it. I thought it was a good balance of a two pack. They all smoked it on the rap side. J I D Cole, like Earth Gang, come on. <laughs> yeah, you know what it's some rapping ass <laughs> niggas. <laughs> yeah, you like Earth Gang? I played one of their records on on a sleeper pick once. Uh, from what I've heard, I like Earth Gang. I want to say Earth Gang is really dope. Yeah. Your old it's, Drew drop. It's project. funny. It's funny answering stuff stuff like that because like, how much do you got to know about somebody to like? Just what you've heard. Oh yeah, from what I've heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just what you've heard. 
But that's them. I, I like what I've heard from all of them over there in that camp. And now that they're more visible, and now that they're dropping more frequently, yeah. That's how I, I feel mean, about Griselda. Like, whenever Benny drops, he's my favorite off the, out the camp. Whenever Conway drops, he's my favorite out the camp. Yeah. Whenever West drops, he's my favorite out the camp. That's it. Oh, no, J.I.D. is my favorite over there. Okay. That's fair. He can rap. That's he it. He can rap very well. Really well. Yeah. Yeah, Drew dropped a project. Who else dropped a project? Shout out to Gold Drew. Link dropped a uh, project. Gold oh, shit, project yeah. Is dope. I thought, yeah. I thought Drew's project. Did we talk about, about the last Link last week because I love Gold Link's album. We weren't here last week. I yeah. mean, when we, the last time we were yeah, here. No, this like dropped. Here. No, no, we weren't here. We weren't here. This dropped. It just a couple days ago. Oh well. Anyways, yeah. yeah. Fuck yeah. No, that gold link shit is great. Yeah, it's fucking oh, perfect for nah. the summer. Oh wait. Well, yeah. shit. In that it's case, new. it might nah, be something that you nah, think we got a different. dicky. We got a dicky then. <laughs> gold link shit is tough. Nah. <laughs> I just said that. I said, is that that, nah, that more nah. record is my shit. That more record's been on repeat. Is that I don't one, even think that's like one, one of Khalid? the big ones. <laughs> huh? I reckon with Khalid. I like the intro. Some R and B shit. He's talking super freestyle joint. Yeah, no, that album is it, man. That Frank record. My record with Khalid is the one though. I like the Tyler record. Uh, we think I mean, Tyler, we That's the record I'm talking about. The Tyler record. Okay. That that hit. That's a. He just a shocked me. I guess. How so? Cause I ain't into Gold Link like that. Okay. I don't know shit about Gold Link. Mm. For for two years I came on here and made fun of uh, money all around which, me. Which is Brent Fayaz too. Like I'm the man. I mean, it's a Gold Link record. No, don't which, do that. But, don't, but yeah, the don't hook do is Brent Fayaz. Don't do that. <laughs> and wait a second. Let me address you. You don't like that fuck. record? I don't. How do you not like that record? Was one of the best records of the record. year, if not two years. Like crew you don't was like the that shit. <laughs> that seems I like a record you I, would like. I always think I would know Joe's musical. Do you think that would be a Joe record all day? Like I don't understand how you don't like that record. You know why? Because. Again, for me now, it's where are you listening to music? Where I wasn't anywhere. Every anytime I was somewhere and that record came on, I hated where I was, and I hated the people that were listening to it, and I hated how the DJ kept bringing it back, and I hated everything about it. That's a buy your pool record all day. You can play that record oh, anywhere. No. Well, well, let's see this summer. Okay, <laughs> this, this, this summer we'll give <laughs> put it on. Well, I'm glad you may, like this gold uh, may, gold link shit. May have different energy. Okay, yeah. we'll see. No, this album's crazy. This album's crazy. When you see me sitting in the pool next to something nice, throw that on. <laughs> I see money, young. Yeah, I need that. I need, <laughs> let me get my shit off. Hey, yeah, hey, more, more hey, hey, like, man. Hey, yeah, yeah. Let me get my shit off. Damn, man. Damn, damn, maybe I can get my shit off to that record. Yeah. See, the music style's a little different when you know, depending where you at, mentally, no, spiritually. I don't need to hear any more cynical jokes, I'm, Mo. I'm just, I'm just saying, bro. <laughs> Relationship, Lily. <laughs> Yo, so OJ on Twitter. <laughs> Crazy. You just missed three free throws in the clutch. <laughs> <laughs> we down? Yeah, man, we needed the free throw. <laughs> um, what else is happening? Who else put music out? Uh game game put music out. I didn't see you put game, it. Game put a nope, song. Oh, single. He put, oh, a, he, he put a single out. How was it? Uh we always say. I heard it once. <laughs> okay. What type of what type of game we getting? Uh, come on, let me find it. Let's find it real quick. Play it's, a little. His game chasing... Know, it's, some, uh, it's some West Coast shit. He didn't name drop. Okay. Oh, that's good. He didn't name drop, and it's some West Coast shit. No, I'm not playing that shit. Okay, all right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you said let's listen to some, yeah, so I, I found I, the chord. I, I, I didn't play no fucking game in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is you talking about? Uh, <laughs> listen, <laughs> yeah, play that thought thing. you were being no, no, you know, not professional. No, he, he played on his. <laughs> he played on his podcast. Played on his. <laughs> yeah, he played on Mike Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, uh, Game snuck a song out. Nick uh, Gucci put put an album out. Okay, I haven't heard it. I have yeah. not either. I haven't yeah, heard, no, it. heard it yet. Uh, Trina put an album out. I heard great reviews. I haven't heard it yet, but people right. seem to like it. You heard great reviews from Trina's album. Yeah, I really? haven't heard it. I saw it all over I my downloaded IG it, story. It. But while we on and and Nicki put a, a song out and a video. Yep, oh, Megatron. I saw the video. I saw the video. I saw the video too. Heard the record. Let's just defer right to Maul. Give it to us. It's okay. It don't even matter. <laughs> no, I know what you mean, but I'm just saying it's... It, yo, it does not matter anymore. Let's start having honest What do you mean it doesn't podcasts. matter? What do you mean it doesn't matter? It doesn't matter if the song is good? No. That's not true. All right. Because if the song is good, it helps. Whatever is happening All right, away wait. from no, the no, music... No, 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 no. That's a fact. Okay. Anything so it being good... It doesn't good, matter. No, it don't. It doesn't matter. Whoa. Something being good, helping. That's a fact always. So it matters. No, it don't. Because there's a million bad songs that perform. And today, all we need, all we're looking at is metrics. 
We're not using our senses. We're not li- using our ears and our eyes. We're not using our brains. If we, there's numbers to it, then the artist is going to meet their goal. So back to my point about Nikki, I don't think that Nikki really cares about music, not just specific to Nikki. I think most artists ain't really giving a fuck about music. Their attention is elsewhere. So you watch that video, it's her Moscato. It's just her Moscato everywhere. When you listen to the verses, it's all about just drinking Moscato. <laughs> and I feel, I feel her. I feel her. Hey, funnel your money to the place where you actually receive most of it, queen. <laughs> I'm not mad at nobody using music to funnel money somewhere else, but I can't judge the music anymore because we're not going in to make the best music. We're going in fighting a corrupt system because we're only paid X amount from 30 seconds worth of a stream. Yeah, but I still think the music, it, it does matter though because you can't, at the end of the day, you, all you have is your reputation. Yeah, that song came on. She said, rah, da, da, da. I didn't care. <laughs> I didn't care at all. It, 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 it. No, no, no. Maybe. <laughs> I was like, all right, Nick. She looked, she, but she, no, she looked great. great. Jeez, the look hold up. She looked Chris great. Chris Brown video too. She, she looked great. great. Yeah, Nikki looks really good right now. <laughs> she looked great. Absolutely. Uh, but I'm still kind of with Maul, man. M- music does matter. I, I guess I get. It's a good commercial, but without the music, you can't just have no good music and all those other things work. And when you're known the, yeah. for music. If it mattered that enough, if, if it mattered that, that much, it'd be some hooks on this Benny project. No, but that's different. Well, those though. are, no, that's a different. No, they ain't getting this money somewhere else. <laughs> no. That's no. not a good comparison at all. Nikki so. is Nikki's Benny, Benny number is one thing that she's known for is making music. So it's, it's tough to be as profitable when do you music think, doesn't Do you hit. think that anybody from Griselda is making their 90% living off of music? No. That's it. Yeah, but, uh, but, but if everything the, if else the music works sucks, because the music the merch is good. I'm not, it's not going to have the same effect. Fam, yo, uh, listen, we, let's keep this cohesive. I just said, I said y'all are right. Music being good helps. That's independent of anything I'm saying. I'm, I'm with y'all. Y'all don't have to argue me there. I'm, no, I'm using If it's word, good, get it. Great. I'm using your word, matter. It's going off what you said. Oh, it's to all, me, to me. I'm not saying to nobody I'm, else. I'm, I'm not saying to no, other no, members. I'm, I'm saying, no, I'm saying to, yeah, to the overall picture of what i'm trying to sell if music is not my number one income it may be my number one attention like no one's gonna no one's walking around going yo i know nikki because she sells moscato i see yeah. what y'all are getting confused. <laughs> like yes. that's not what she's known for yes y'all are the right. music gotta hit yeah. to us to at least a certain degree for that moscato to matter okay for me it don't matter same with the merch to grizel to your griselda point like if the music was trash they yeah, the, the merch shirt. looks great, but it brings way more attention because a lot, to Because a lot of rappers have merch. I don't know if y'all know that. <laughs> well, and their music no, their is trash. Is, they ain't and, none of that merch, merch moving. And, and the fire. conversation that we're having right now, if you're just asking my opinion and we're not doing Wale deep dive every week, <laughs> that, that is the issue. With, that is Wale's problem. He don't have something to funnel back to. He just keep putting out great music. Hmm. And he's wondering why he's not receiving what he should be receiving. Because people you, don't like him. Enough people like Wale for him to be able to funnel uh, his interest to a, a, a project where he receives more of the pie. Which is why Steve Harvey got fired. So I read, anyway. Is Wale married? I don't know. I have no idea. No idea. I, I don't know. And I, I think don't that's what he's missing. I, I think he needs, to be, he needs to be tied to a few more... Uh, if you want, uh, that was jo- that women. was Joe's point. Big Wally, yeah, I, I made that point uh, yeah, a few weeks I think ago. He needs to, and you laughed at me, but I mean, I was making a serious point. No, but when I said <laughs> it, it, a good it, woman will it's make funny, will, will but shift, will skew perception of you. Not and not just a perception. It, it will bring the it, softer it, side out of of you. It it, it, it makes likeable. it gets attention <laughs> yeah. from the women. It gets attention from the guys. Yeah. Like, oh shit, he got a. a I think a lot of, of Chris getting own. back in people's good graces was Karuchi. Karuchi was mad likable. It's a sweet girl. Right. Are we going to talk about... Um, that was my segue. <laughs> oh, you did good. <laughs> Put my day seven. It's my day seven holding it down while he's in L.A. and here. <laughs> it's everywhere. <laughs> Yo, are we going to discuss this? I don't... I, y'all got to tackle it, but y'all got to unpack it for real, like unfiltered and aggressive, because I like Chris. I don't want to say nothing bad. Chris mm-hmm. got chill. <laughs> Chris Hacker just wound up on Victor Cruz page. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what he said? He got hacked? Of course you know he hit him with the I was hacked. You gotta say I got hacked. Oh, 
Uh, I was hacked by the Jameson. Yeah. 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 <laughs> hacked by the drugs. Yeah. Or, hey, yeah. niggas don't never tell us who they was hacked by. Yeah. The Kush. Uh, that cocaine yeah. is crazy. So you always get hacked by the cocaine. Cocaine always gets my password. Yeah. <laughs> How does it happen? iCloud and Coke. Yeah. <laughs> I Coke. I Coke. <laughs> I coke. I coke. Holy <laughs> shit. Yo, uh, listen. He said he was hacked. He said he was hacked. Then if he said he was hacked, God damn it, he was hacked. No, for, he, for no. those that don't know, he was hacked. God damn it, he was. Yeah, he was. was. I'm, I'm rolling with him. Yeah. I, I, listen, I ain't going against him too. We get these songs. Yeah. <laughs> After that, we can go against him. I'm not him. rolling yeah, yeah, with. I'm phony. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not rolling with. It was hacked simply because it wasn't. And two, <laughs> because he then he doubled that down was on Rory it. Rory McFarrell, Jersey City, Bergen Avenue. I don't uh, live on Bergen anymore. I wouldn't give you a real address. All right, thanks. On, on here, text me, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the square. <laughs> it, I'm moving. I know. I know, Rory. <laughs> uh, also, when he doubled down on it, like, no shade, but hold on. I meant that, but seriously, hope the best for y'all. <laughs> <laughs> it was like three comments in a row, so I know he typed it and then went, fuck. Yo. All right, well, let me type it again. Yo. Chris Brown's account is not going to be hacked that long <laughs> no. for you to get three and four messages. So I was like, no. I'm, I love Chris Brown. I do. Mm -hmm. I feel like a part of him speaks to the part of some men that we can never claim. All of us. I agree us. with you. No, I agree All, with you. Fam, listen to me. But I'm not doing and that. This is, I'm never doing it either. Am I'm, I thinking I'm, it? I'm, I'm cool, but Maybe. fam. Do you know how many times you want to go to the guy's page that she's fucking and say, yo, yo dog, yo, <laughs> this the one? <laughs> yo, what are you doing with this fucking bozo? <laughs> what are you, like, everybody wants to do that. Come on, man. That's some funny shit to be sitting home as Chris Brown. Do you do some shit like that? No, this long in like you know why this like know, yo Chris. No, nah, but fuck you know why you, you know why it's ill. And ladies, listen, listen, listen. Uh, as men, we do understand the severity of it. So let me let me put that disclaimer and, and we out here. Understand that Carucci and Vic are this very is, happy. We're here no, no, for all that. I ain't even talking. I'm talking about uh, the 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 past between Chris Brown and Carucci is a sensitive one and a delicate one, and we understand that. So, but that's part of why I'm kind of laughing because she got him blocked. He can't go to her page. <laughs> no, you're gonna find a way. You're gonna find a way. Yeah, but not yeah, as not as is. not as at Chris Brown official. No, <laughs> fam, Chris Brown going to Victor Cruz's page <laughs> and saying, "Yo, dog, that salsa shit is a rap." <laughs> <laughs> Why he, went at he my, why, so, why Chris? Why he went at my nigga Vic like that? Though, so man. what? You know he wanted to say some foul shit. He's talking about Victor Cruz dresses. Ain't Victor Cruz like the kid model? Him and he, Fab. He's, he's one of them. Yes. Oh, he's done campaigns. I think he has own. Does he own a piece of? He Kith? owns Maybe. Kith. He's Kith. He's Kith. <laughs> he is Kith. Yes. Victor, Victor Cruz. Kifter. Kifter. Kifter Cruz. Kifter Cruz. You know it's fucked up. Karuchi ain't, ain't even jump in. Like, man, fuck this nigga. They just oh, ignored that nigga. Victor wouldn't put on some more crazy shit. <laughs> Karuchi gave it to him. Throw this on. Next. Yo, but you know what's funny? And, and, and I'm not going to say you know what's funny, but women, after they leave. That'd be trash, though, if your girl style you and then you go out and get clowned and you just got to eat it. Got to. <laughs> All right, which one do you prefer? The girl, your girl leaving you and getting with a dude that's like the total opposite of you, or would you like her to get with a dude in your same ballpark, like a ill or you? <laughs> get with the nah. ill or me. Get with the lame. Nah, get with the ill or me. Because at least, you, at least when you get with an iller version oh, yeah, wait, of me. Do, do, hold on, do I still want her? Um, That's a good question. Give oh, me both. Matters. Give me yeah. yes or no. Yeah. Uh, if I don't want her, go with the iller me. Let me get some jokes off And go with the lame If I still want If you, you do want her Yes Got it See I'm the opposite I feel like if if my ex If she get with a lame That I'm means turned she still off. want me so Nah I'm turned off excited. I'm like are you, this nigga Nah I know what But what if is. he's like good for her And stuff you know I was about that. we're, That's we're fine no, no, that's, was, Lame dudes are way No that's fine yeah. too Guys but, and girls Never know exactly how to gauge lame When it's their but like, listen but lame us. is lame is what we deem it to be. Whatever we see, because <laughs> yeah. yeah, there's the way, never no consensus of what lame is. Yeah. Like that's how we think. Even if he's treating her the way she always wanted to be treated, mad respectful, and even that's lame. uplifting her. <laughs> we send her yeah, like this yeah, lame yeah, ass, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and even that's part of being lame. Why 
Why you treating her good yeah. like that? Man? Yo, this I'm nigga opening the door yo, for you and shit. Benny Hanna's get it done. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, tell, I'm, fam, I'm yeah, telling you, yeah, you're overpaying. Yeah, yeah. Fam, you're <laughs> overpaying. You're overpaying, yeah, fam. You're making her think she's worth yeah. it. <laughs> You making it's her not, feel like a I queen. It's yeah. not gonna work yeah, out in the long yeah, run. Yeah, come on, you fam. got two months. <laughs> Yo, you wait. want this toxic oh, shit? Wait, you that's... making her feel like a queen. <laughs> Yo, Rory is so sick. Ain't that the best when like you see them like being happy together? But you know she a piece of shit. Yeah, so, you right. know she don't you want get that. Out about a few months. Yeah. <laughs> nah, you'll be right back here. Yeah, yeah. I know your type. Yo, it's me. <laughs> I know your type. You never hit the blunt before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never hit a blunt before. Right <laughs> now, you smoking. Now you smoking. <laughs> now you know what indica is. I know. Don't you, do that. Don't go bringing the new nigga the swag I gave you. Don't yeah, do that. Yeah. Oh, that's don't always do, happening. Don't no. <laughs> Fam, sin took candles out my house. Shirts. <laughs> I feel for you because I know candles is your shit. She yeah. on Instagram every day and in a Joe shirt about I self love. Yeah. <laughs> Boss, positive vibes. I like you a fucking shirt. How about that? I did not I read on the internet That candles was like Your shit I read on the internet Fam, you, you, you walked in this house You got a fucking uh, Run around them Just like cones I, I On the basketball court to say what to. <laughs> How you fucking I didn't really want to I just wanted to suddenly wait, Nah it's cool It's wait, cool what were nah, it's cool. It was cool But I just want to see If I can guess his segue What, what he was I, saying I just read that you Like the, candles the was like Connie review. and shit Maybe a review I kind of read one time That like maybe That's what she was into Was this a case Of Mendeecees Having his cake And eating it too because when he wasn't with Yandy, can y'all stop talking over the drop? Stop, stop talking over it. We're doing a podcast with Erica. Would he be back with Yandy? You got a dick you to hit the streets. Harry determined pregnancies would have some overlap. My shit, y'all want to hit the chat with my shit? Nah, where you sit? Nah, fuck you. Mine's is fake. Yours is real. Mine's is fake. Listen, you my man, but I just want to. I just want to know. Hey, how you spell dick, yo? <laughs> I don't know, fam. All right. Okay. Parks. <laughs> this is where I think maybe that shit might be true. Hmm. Remember, we were all up in the green room, me, you, and Maul. I hate when a story starts. I do remember R- that. Remember. Yeah. Remember, remember there was a. You got to think. Yeah, remember. Yeah. I hate this nigga. Get it off, cook. <laughs> Remember there was the TV You could see the stage That's true And you know how Just me, you, and Maul Usually kick it after the show Joe yeah. just go He leave right away yeah. We dap the fans We get to know everyone We yeah. talk to them we hear pants. about their stories We get yeah. to know everyone No, we do That's, that's, our, that's our bag <laughs> So Yo. for some reason At this DC show You'll never, you'll never Joe get another stayed, vacation I'll tell you that one <laughs> Joe stayed after the show like, like He was We was looking at the TV At the stage Like <laughs> No, he, he didn't just stay after He stayed after after so I, like, <laughs> like after we left, that was so stupid. after an I, hour, Joe was still there, <laughs> dapping up the sound guys. And I just, I, first of all, you know I know, you know I know this chick that <laughs> whether this is true or not, I know her name. But she said her name was Ashley. Ashley is sick uh, for, for adding Savon we'll in the review. Ashley. <laughs> Whoever, she said, yo, Joe but Button whoever, Pod, Dick Yelp, and Savon. Let me tell you about Joe. Who, yeah, who, whoever <laughs> this is, clearly they are a podcast listener. And they sound like a, rom- a romantic novel author. <laughs> I was intrigued. <laughs> you know the funny shit about Dick Yelp is, like, I'm waiting to catch one of you niggas slipping. <laughs> like, I'm reading them. Sorry. <laughs> hey, if you niggas is underperforming, I'm a no. Hey, yo. <laughs> what? Hey, yo. You read my shit, nigga. Yeah, because I wanted yeah. to laugh at you. See? Wait, how read come you didn't send this shit to the chat, man? Because we were on vacation. Because it's not real. And it's not real. <laughs> it's not real, more. Oh, so it wasn't on a dick yo page? No, yes, it, was. it was. No, it was on there. All right. I got How y'all know it wasn't real? Cause all right, let me read it to you. Bro. I don't know. Oops, Joe saying oops sounds kind of. <laughs> 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 I can see nuts. Joe saying oops. <laughs> he says oops all the time. Nah, that's the part that had me like, whoa. That was me. That <laughs> <laughs> might be true. <laughs> all right. Uh, at, this person says, and Maul, I don't know why you're making me waste precious podcast time with this fake story, but it's cool. How y'all know it's fake? All right, mm. let me let me read it. Let me read it, and uh, then you tell me. But pause. You act like I'm gonna just know off the read, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, like nah, he don't even be doing that. <laughs> my, my son don't get down like that. Boy, yeah. <laughs> Yo, my son don't give it up. My son don't give it up like. That. I used to live with son. He don't give it up. <laughs> Fuck you mean, Joe? Like, well, let me read it so you can fuck you mean. 
I used to live with son. He don't give it up like that. Well, you did used to live with son, and you know I don't give it up like that. Because you saw me fuck when you got up and ironed the clothes that day. And I didn't do it. Yo, stop. You, you no, seen me fuck. Stop doing when that, you man. Stop, clothes stop. When you finished I early. That. I didn't do that. You was, I, I don't know if they called you an eight, but I was in the room. <laughs> it was only eight seconds. Yeah, it wasn't. It didn't seem so eightish. Rory, you, the love. <laughs> the love. I feel the love in the room. Don't yeah, worry about it. You probably grew to the eight. <laughs> that was yeah. <quite> progression. <laughs> Artist development. Fox, don't do that. Don't do that, Fox. See what I'm saying? Don't do that, though, Fox. You can't do that. No, nah, you don't do that. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Knew your yeah. bag. Like, oh, <laughs> yeah, yo. Y'all are sick. <sighs> I would never hang out with Maul if I knew, like, he was some ill sex nigga. What you mean? <laughs> I swear Yo, to God. How you, run you the, how you run the twos with someone that's like ill? Yo, listen. Yeah, nah, I'm not doing that. Read Yo, your shit. Y'all read Yo, my shit. If you out there giving I bitches, know, I, you yeah. out there giving bitches nah. mad pleasure, nigga. Yeah. Don't I, can't, I can't run twos yeah. with the stallion. Don't, don't hit the block with me. <laughs> well, oh, shit. Where's your shit at? I, I want to hear your shit. I got you right here. Here we go. <sighs> no, start with the ats. <laughs> no, it's really no. start with the beginning. Uh, I'm done. Uh. At Joe Budden. At Joe Budden Pod. At Savon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Jesus. Y'all, y'all are really stupid. All right. I have had my eye on Mr. Budden for a while now, especially amid rumors of him having an old man dick and his lack of stamina by his own admission, but I didn't believe it. No way this man candy couldn't hold his own. So when the opportunity presented itself, I was there. It was after the DC show, and I waited until he did his rounds and spoke to everyone, which took forever. It's true. I almost didn't approach him, but I was determined. Finally, (laughs) Rory, you're an idiot. Finally, he was wrapping things up, so I sashayed up to him, extended my hand, and said hi. I saw someone sashay up to him. I remember the sashay. You You did, right? And said, hi, I'm Ashley. He immediately looked intrigued, and with one brow raised, he gave me a raspy, well, hello there. That's you. That's That's you. One brow. You just did one brow right now. (laughs) Thanks. (laughs) Uh, That sounds funny. A little bit, the audio. Uh, He said, uh, oh, well, hello there. After some playful banter. Playful banter. You're definitely a, you definitely playfully banter. And banter, yeah. That's kind of my go-to. <laughs> I be want to play. Uh, he invited me back to his hotel room. We walked in the candles lit everywhere. That's you. Wait, so look, you just left the candles lit from the whole show? Y'all like walked in? That's why your bag be so heavy? Wait, they said hotel room? <laughs> yeah. You stay in the hotel in D.C. <clears throat> candles lit everywhere, that's a lie. In the hotel oh, room. Whoa, how you know I don't give it up like that? <laughs> Joe definitely packs You do the see that he packs that travel with yeah. candles? Yeah. Yeah. I was sick well, nigga, man. We walked into candles lit everywhere and R&B music. This I is won- Joe. Yeah. I wondered if the candles were lit the whole time. Anyway, I slipped off <laughs> my good I slipped off my heels and followed him to the couch where I sat on his lap and a heavy makeout session commenced. Ooh, You're yeah, a white boy bag. bag. Yes, yeah, it's bad. Come, on, don't do that, more. Joe be kissing. <laughs> He did. Joe be kissing. I haven't kissed since 07. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what I'm telling you. Something. It's a wild year to make I'm out. Telling you something. <laughs> nah, 07 was a good year for I'm, making out. I'm the master of the tongueless make out. I'm giving you mad lip. <laughs> tongueless, <laughs> tongueless make out. <laughs> mad, <laughs> mad uncertainty. <laughs> mad uncertainties in the make out. Yo, y'all niggas acting like y'all don't know what I'm talking about. Giving a mad top to bottom lip. <laughs> Man, you ain't gonna talk. Yeah, nah. You fucking trifling Harley. Don't you yeah. put your tongue on my tongue. Yeah, nah, yeah. Nobody, <laughs> get some of this everybody lip. can't get no tongue. Yeah, yeah no. and then I'm Noxzema in the lip and Colgate it down next morning. <laughs> Noxzema <laughs> the lip. <laughs> Yo, you know you was with a Harley. You brush your teeth and then fucking hit the lips with the brush. <laughs> yeah. Need that water wick shit. The outside of your <laughs> lips. Water wick. Yeah. <laughs> Hell, shit, I need a car wash for my lips. <laughs> Y'all are stupid, man. All right, no, wait. Uh, where we at here with this stupid nonsense? Uh, commence. My lips slowly traveled lower. <laughs> See, that ain't happened to me since 99. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch ain't never had her lips slowly yeah, travel. Slowly yeah, travel. Come on, Ma. Yeah. Where's your number? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to give you a real yeah, review. It hit me. Uh, uh, <laughs> anyway, I, I slipped on my heels and followed him to the couch. Oh, wait. Where am I? I lost it. Oh, my lips slowly traveled lower, and to my surprise, 
His pants were already at his ankles and his dick was out. That's OG, OG move. Now. OG move. Oh, come on, day seven. That's my day seven. You know that's my move. That is my move, though. Pants to the ankle, that's Joe. 100%. Yeah, that's Joe. <laughs> Cheeks on the couch. <laughs> no, on, the, no. on the leather. No. <laughs> on, on the leather, leather couch. <laughs> with your hey. cheeks. Hey, you a nasty nigga if you got bare cheeks on a leather couch, my nigga. That's disgusting. I did. That That's disgusting. nasty, I did. man. That's <laughs> I did it. <laughs> and then get stuck to it. <laughs> and get stuck to it. I don't care what y'all say. Okay, my bad. Little Velcro butt. <laughs> you getting up to change, to change position. She thinks you farted. <laughs> little Velcro booty. Velcro booty. <laughs> Give it to him a little bit. Uh, uh, to my surprise, his pants were already at his ankles and his dick was out. See, that's true. You got to do it like when she look away or something like, yo, change the channel. <laughs> <laughs> Consensually, of course. Uh, <laughs> yes, call Rory. yes, Rory. <laughs> Just see, why, see why we need Rory human resources? Uh, pants already at. When did he have the time to do that? <laughs> she was surprised Yeah you know I mean I did that shit fast Like the breakaways Anyway I proceed Wait, jeans on <laughs> and you, you accused me of this yeah. Cause like I your Breakaway game. denim <laughs> Breakaway nah, and denim they, And they was nude <laughs> <laughs> They didn't match my complexion. That's a fear of God, parents. That's a new yeah. fear of God. You know what I mean? Yeah. Something, something like. And he yeah. was freeballing with the <laughs> she denim. Said, she said, oh, my. Well, first of all, if the second I know she's coming over, I'm freeballing. Yeah, that's a fact. Wait, what is it? No, with, no, with the denim. Commando. I'm saying no, 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 freeballing with the no, denim. No, 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 no. I take it back. I'm not yeah, freeballing yeah. with the denim. <laughs> you know. If you a sick nigga, if you do that. Word. That's a Free, rough. But no, no underwear with jeans on? That's a rough sit. <laughs> fam. Come on, fam. Who you just killed? Yo, and anytime you go in a way to like do some shit nasty, like take the drawers off. Chicks always, chicks always ask with you, hey, what are you going in the bathroom to do? Oh, no, I'm just prepared to knock your whole fucking <laughs> Put your fucking hey, head through the I, headboard. That's what I'm ready to go prepare I, I, for. I, I had enough of my, this friction my dick keep feeling rubbing up on you. Guess what's happening next? As soon as I come out of the, as soon as I come out of the commode. <laughs> As soon as I nurse my dick after all that. As soon as I come out of this commode. Wait. Yeah. No, wow. the commode. Yeah, as soon as I come Why out of this commode. Hey, what are you going in the bathroom to do? What do you think? We're just going to keep rubbing each yeah. other for the next hour, bitch? <laughs> nah, knocking your fucking head off. Yeah, you should wait fact. till I get out. Uh, damn, man. Yo, y'all are fucking idiots. Can I finish the story? Go ahead, man. Anyway, I proceeded with fellatio, and it had to have been 45 seconds before I began choking from cum exploding everywhere. Now, that sounds right. I looked up to Joe giving me a sheepish grin as he let out an oops. That's you. She's not <laughs> word. You definitely have sheep and you say oops. That's yeah. true. I've said oops, oops. man. Times. Uh, it's an icebreaker. <laughs> Are you <Yeah>. icebreaker. <laughs> Busting her mouth. At the Busting quick seconds. and saying oops. Saying oops. It's the icebreaker. <laughs> now we cool. Now we kicking. Wait. I said, are you fucking kidding me? He looked confused as to why I was upset, and I said, you couldn't last a minute? He had the nerve to get loud and start a rant on how I should be lucky I got that, and how soon, when the robots take over, I'm going to be wishing that they came fast. I, I, I would be wishing that they came fast after getting locked jaw from Robo Dick not coming. Wait, what? This, this still sounds like you. Yeah, it might be you, bro. <laughs> I left mid-rant disappointed. I didn't even get to use my best moves. Yes, yeah, me. The rumors are definitely <laughs> true. Needless to say, this was an express car wash. Whoa. <laughs> Killed you there. <laughs> I see how you tied that one together. <laughs> an express car they wash. They posted that on that page? Yeah, but she knew that was bullshit. Oh, okay. She, she said, she said, yeah, I don't believe this, but I'm posting this for shits and giggles. <clears throat> it's funny. And, 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 and it worked. She said, funny. She said, putting that shit out, give me some followers. She got the followers. She put it out. It was funny. It was hilarious. Yeah. You got to know when the real Joe shit is. She didn't even give you a rating. Yeah, it worked. I thought that She's was the a, point. This is Yelp. She said it was an express Yelp. car wash. Thrives on the rating. Express car washes <laughs> are handy sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. You need them. You yeah. Got to get in and out. Got to get in and out. That's a yeah. fact. You gotta get in and out. Anyway, this shit is fucked up where guys have to like worry about how they perform with people that they don't really care about. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, and the girls tried to take away our excuse from way back. Why well, beat though? <laughs> Remember that day on Twitter when they tried to get that one out of here? Yeah. I called that immature. Yeah. Sorry. I do remember. Yeah. That wasn't gonna change that. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry, sis. <laughs> still hey, still I, beat. I beat it. It's still effective still. <laughs> um all right, what else is what else do we need to talk about? Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see on our speed cast. Let me see fresh up VK, BT weekend, BT weekend, anything about BT weekend we need, we need, we need, we need. No, not really. Wait a minute. Yes, that's, yes, 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 that's in this room. Let's get to Cardi. Okay. Uh songwriter of the year. 
What did they give her? Round of applause. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> Not BT. Ass Cap. Ass Cap gave her Songwriter of the Year. Which is worse. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah BT we cannot consider. Ass Cap represents the writers. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I'd love to hear y'all try your best to stay safe here. Let me, let me try. <laughs> let me give it my best go. All right, so wait, let me if just ASCAP be clear. ASCAP is going off numbers, and she is credited on every single song that she's written on, which she is, you could make a case that she would be songwriter of the year if you're going off the numbers. That's I tried. I tried. Yeah, it worked. He got me. <laughs> get I'm, out. I'm on his side. Just All right. now, now try to get out. He convinced me. Get out, though. What do you mean? Get out of here. Like, leave, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you mean with why me? Get out. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> You're not rolling? Fuck no. I'm not but what, rolling tell me, but He tried, but no. I believed him. I think they meant party. They, they just misplaced it. It's party, not Cardi. Okay. That deserves it. Uh, I'm rolling with that. Yeah. Y'all are haters. <laughs> I'm rolling with that, too. <laughs> yeah. Well, we can hate all, all we want. She did win ASCAP Songwriter of well, the Year. Well, congrats so congratulations to her. Congrats to Party. One. Cardi, Cardi. Um, Cardi, Cardi uh, went to court for the same old shit. Same old shit. Her and the, uh, the two strippers that... That shit was, from over here? Still going from on. years ago. Yeah. From last year, two years ago, when a Damn. fight broke out and, you shit, know... Shit moved slow and he got paid lawyers. Yeah. Well, in New York, in New York court, you're gonna keep coming back. Yeah, that's you're true. Keep, you mm-hmm. keep coming back. So, uh, so that case is still happening. Uh, TMZ reported on that case in TMZ fashion. They said, "What did they say? 13, 13 charges, some felony, some not. Blah 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 blah. I don't know. I'm not reading it, and don't quote me. And if you get your news from here, you're a loser." Um, <laughs> and then Cardi responded to TMZ. Naturally, I, I will say I like I like this age of uh, <clears throat> I like Cardi responding to uh, BT. I mean uh, TMZ. I do. I like when LeBron responds. Like there's certain people I just like when they respond. So I'm gonna read it. Cardi says, "Harvey, you wrinkle fake tan bitch." Okay. I'm on board. You don't profit on talking about white celebrities, so you go out of your way to report shit on people in the urban culture and even make shit up. Pardon me. It's crazy how two months ago my publicist had to go out of her way to prove to you guys that I had surgery because you insisted that I was pregnant. And you was doing it, uh, and you, wait, pregnant, and you was going to report it because a reliable source claims to have told you. I never did jail time. I do not have a criminal record. But they want to drag this case because they want fame, they want press, waste people's tax money on this bullshit case, a misdemeanor case. I don't understand how I've been to court six times for a misdemeanor, a fucking misdemeanor, and now you try to upgrade upgrade it to a felony E, the lowest of the low because I refuse to agree to your terms. The prosecutors are in meetings talking about she hangs with gang members. But uh, let me stop here for a minute. You understand perfectly, Cardi, because you just perfectly described it. This is how this process goes. You go to court for one thing. They see how much you have to support what you're saying. If they need more, they trump up the charges Mm. in hopes to get you to plead to something that you did not do, all of which you're stating here. Um, You refused to take the plea, so here we are. They're going to just continue to try to trump shit up, right? And she has a pretty good understanding of that because she explains it pretty well here. The prosecutors are in meetings talking about she hangs with gang members, but uh, but uh, y'all don't say my clean ass record. Talk about all the private donations I gave that are in my bank statements, the charity events I performed for, or how I or how I got the keys from Marlboro, Brooklyn, that my gang member. Marlboro, Brooklyn, that my gang member friends arranged to give out coats, something you white motherfuckers don't do uh, for the community. You don't do shit to better the community, but harass and depress. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm with her. I'm with on that. This is dangerous. Why is that? Why you say it's dangerous? Because this is the truth. (laughs) Because, yeah. Well, not only that, but you are young, rich, and successful. 
and you are now in the hands of the law where we are powerless and we already know how that's set up because you just told us about it. I'm only talking from my own personal experience. When you lash out, and that is considered a lash out, even though it's all true. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's when it's a lash out, yeah. when it's true. <laughs> when you lash out, the percentages raise of them looking to make some type of example out of you, one, or uh, for them to be a lot less lenient because of how you are using your socials. It happened to me when I was saying, hey, yo, yo I'll be on Steinway if you want to arrest me. <laughs> like, come get me. I didn't do shit. Suck my dick. Like, that's what I was saying. And and when I got in front of that judge and it was time to hear bail at 1 a.m. and I had to find 20,000 cash, I was like, damn, it's a little harsh at 2 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. No, no, it's Bar's not. still open. No, it's not. No, it's not. When the when the, uh, prosecutor uh, come tell your lawyer, hey, uh, we read all the tweets. Like, we read the tweets, everything you're saying. So that's all I'm saying. I agree with everything she's saying here. But this could get ugly. This case is however many years old, Right. Cardi gonna keep getting more successful. She's just gonna keep getting more money. This might be a money grab, but these girls probably got some money behind them. <laughs> See, and that's the part that don't nobody want to talk about. This might not go away because somebody might be behind these girls to continue pushing this. Mm. Now, that's all I'm saying there, and I'm gonna continue to watch it. And I pray that Cardi as well, all said as well, all uh, the the young ladies are. Oh well, y'all know me. I don't want nobody to be hurt or fucked up or any of that, but. These money grabs is rough. It will probably lead to a settlement. I'm sure. Uh, I would assume. But just judging from Cardi's tone, she don't sound like she's trying to pay you bitches nothing. Yeah, I I'm mean, not taking a plea and I'm not paying you nothing. <laughs> I mean, most people stand on that until it becomes inconvenience. Like now she has to travel. The time. From, yeah, yeah, the time. It's like I'll keep having to come back to New York to deal with this and I keep having... It's, it's sometimes it's just better to just be like, yo, you know what, whatever. Yeah, at some point you gotta value your yeah, time like, fuck versus this shit. The, like I'm, I'm sick of coming to court for this bullshit. No, it's true. I agree. I agree. Um, all right, what else do we have that we have to hit? Match it, match it. Let's see, let's see. Cardi, uh, wrote a, sometimes labels is right. O, o, OJ on Twitter. <coughs> oh, we're finally here. <laughs> That's not a segue. <laughs> You've been waiting. <laughs> OJ's on Twitter. I did love his first tweet. I loved his video. I loved uh, his positive attitude and then said, I have some scores to settle. And, and That was it. a little weird. <laughs> I didn't follow OJ. <laughs> OJ definitely plays around with the fact that everybody thinks he is a murderer. Absolutely. He knows. Like I mean, he, says, he says little <laughs> shit and the way he says it, it's like, this nigga look like... He came he on really... Twitter for the scores to settle? Yeah. Or, like, uh, what scores are you talking <laughs> you gonna about? You going to at Darden? Yeah. Like, come on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Worry, this nigga got a hit list somewhere? <laughs> yes. Well, <laughs> how old is OJ? Is he seventy yet? He's probably seventy. No, nah, I, nah, I don't think I he's seventy yet. Sixty-six. People would be my guess. Seventy-one. Yep. Wow, oh, I'm way off. Seventy-one. Damn, yeah, OJ's already seventy-one. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Should OJ not not be on Twitter? I mean. I saw somebody. There's say, a lot uh, of things OJ should not be doing. But I saw somebody saying Twitter's I'm not, included there. Really. I think he could be on Twitter, but he could be like not saying I have scores to settle. He when your first, well, I say he probably, probably when you do first like that. When your first tweet is a video of you in your backyard saying this is going to be great, I have all my opinions on everything, and then I have some scores to settle. You should not be on Twitter. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's settling the score. Fresh off the first tweet, yeah. you shouldn't be on there. Get it off, OJ. It's 2019. Twitter's not as crazy as it used to be. Stay away from this Twitter, <laughs> OJ Simpson. <laughs> And that, that's that's I think about that often. That Twitter really is a whole different place. It's way different place. today. It's, it's completely. It's, it's safe. The streets are clean. It's like New Brooklyn. Yeah. It's like old Brooklyn to New Brooklyn. Yeah. Like and the, and there's still no East New York Brownsville part of Bed Stuy. Like that doesn't exist either. Yeah. <laughs> it's old Williamsburg. It's just it's not Brooklyn. It's just Williamsburg is the whole place. Williamsburg, New York. <laughs> yes. Because I saw I saw somebody saying oh uh, they shouldn't. Oh, if you're going to be on Twitter, then make sure you send every tweet to the parents of Nicole and, and the gentleman. That, well, that wouldn't be a good idea either. I think you just follow him. I was like, well, All right. how if OJ th- followed the two of them. If OJ o- o- shouldn't follow anybody. <laughs> yeah, first he, and foremost. He did fo- that fo- before. Following should be the last thing that, that <laughs> he does. He's followed. What if he follows like the, the Chevy Twitter page? 
For the Ford Bronco <laughs> The Ford Bronco The Ford, the Ford Twitter page <laughs> See if I'm OJ I'll do shit like that <laughs> Love your 92 model <laughs> yeah. It's a great car I would do that I would follow the Ford What's page. his homeboy's name? That was driving uh, AC AC You gotta follow AC, AC. Collins You yeah, don't talk to that nigga no more <laughs> That's crazy AC you ain't drive fast enough yeah. <laughs> What are you talking about? We got caught nigga Yeah, yeah. You go. drove me back to my crib Yeah, yeah <laughs> Word You called the police While I was in the car Trying to kill myself I'm alive because of you <laughs> Fucking I'm miserable <laughs> I told you Bring me to the gravesite. Let me off myself Next thing I know I'm in my driveway Yeah <laughs> OJ was mad as hell. His son was all trying to hug him. Like, move, man. <laughs> <laughs> My whole plan is fucked up. Oh, poor AC, man. Uh, poor AC from an OJ story. Uh, yeah, I didn't. I didn't agree with. I didn't agree with uh, that take. I don't think that everything he does should be looped back into uh, uh, the victims, uh, especially when you know he's just always going to turn to. I. I didn't get. I was acquitted. <laughs> yeah. But but listen. I, he was acquitted. Yeah, like that's just the bottom line. I'm not gonna keep saying that because he did that shit. But, <laughs> but the justice system. Listen, and just injustice will happen. Injustice is house because justice is wild. Bars. Y'all think OJ did it though? Honestly, yes, yes. Yeah. All three, yeah, <laughs> yes. absolutely. I just said yes. <laughs> I don't think he did it. I think he knows who did it. Oh, um, but I don't think he actually did it. I think that him and his man did it. And I think his I think his man probably should we even be saying all this? <laughs> I'm spooked out now. Hold up. He has some scores to settle. Oh, see the OJ DM. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I ain't gonna know. I, I don't know. My name is Ben. My name is my name is Paul, and that's on y'all. I don't know. Sorry. Damn. Damn. I don't think he did it. He knows. I think he knows, but I don't think he did it. I think. Yeah, he probably he definitely yo, knows. Yo, yeah, Rashid is different, man. Yeah, <laughs> Rashid right. think that shit is conspiracy. How many? Can I ask y'all a question? How many conversations in your life, if you had to guess, do you think you've had with somebody that killed somebody? Uh, oh, I, I know, I know, <laughs> I know. A handful. I have friends that I know killed me. Shh. Yeah, I mean, I ain't going to telling no names. Yeah. Big podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's not part of life. Not listeners. <laughs> Yeah, all right, maybe quite a few. Wasn't a good question to ask. Okay, Cuba, good answer. <laughs> Listen, man, <laughs> Cuba's been Cuba. in America. Cuba, good answer. <laughs> what well, Cuba uh, did, man? But y'all no, seen no, the we, video? We're not getting into Cuba. Yes, I saw the video. What, what Cuba did, man? He was being handsy. A little handsy. Yeah. Handsy in the sky lounge. Handsy. Yeah. <laughs> a little handsy. Yeah, and it's fucked up because Cuba, at some point, uh, the ladies like really wanted him to beat. Like he was a sex symbol at some point. Yeah, I remember when the chicks like you. Yeah. There was a time. What movie was that? Well, there was a movie. Uh, radio. It was. <laughs> <laughs> we we're gonna get canceled. <laughs> like I feel like there's been at least five minutes of inappropriate jokes ever since this <laughs> radio. No, nah, but you okay. got The reason why that's funny because you got to think back to radio. Though I remember radio. Who want to beat radio? <laughs> <laughs> no, we shouldn't further on with the convo. We should change the subject. Yeah, I don't understand y'all. No, just, it's just, I'm just asking. My eye, right, never mind. Never mind. You just got to think about yo. when he was pushing the car. Yo. No, no. Who I, in the neighborhood was like, yo? <laughs> Ma, we all That's understood the, the joke. The Ma. joke needs no explanation. I got to think about it, though, man. Ma. It's jokes, but come on, man. God damn, radio. Like, imagine you pull up to your girl house to see radio cart. Like, I was <laughs> by the back door. <laughs> radio in there beating your queen. <laughs> I'm glad you're having a blast. I was I was super mad at the end of that movie. You was there? What in that movie? I was super mad at the end of that movie. What happened to them? Oh, it was I'm, a true oh, story, wasn't it? I, I give yeah. a fuck. Why were you mad? mad? I can't say it. Oh, oh <laughs> I can't never say mind it. But yeah, I, I was I was super mad at that movie. Fucking Cuba Gooden running around being radio the old nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Joe is so Joe is stupid. Like I can see Joe and feel like, on. look at this Come shit. <laughs> yo, yo, no, him being radio in that movie. Will Smith in the Pursuit of Happiness when he was carrying around that fucking box. Oh, I was mad at that fucking thing the whole time. Man, find a better way to fucking what? carry this. That was bullshit. his hustle. I, I was mad at it. And what what else I was mad at? Oh. Uh, in fresh, 
A nigga, a nigga, you don't just walk up to the ch- uh, chest board and now you just the illest nigga in the world. Call next. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the shit Joey mad I get mad at little shit in the movie. Little, you're the little 13 year old nigga coming up to all the parks nice. in New York yeah. beating everybody. The nigga, go to where my grandma used to be. <laughs> <laughs> hey, go to that yeah. senior citizen center right there across from Harlem Hospital on 35th. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't go, doing all go that. Go right down 45th yeah. and Lennox. <laughs> yeah, get, get out of Union Square. Yeah, let me see you get that off. You ain't getting that off on 145th and Lennox. I was up there on a 20-game win streak before homeboy robbed me in broad daylight with the cops right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I thought you was lying about that all these years until niggas uptown told me. They said, yo, you know Joe got robbed over there. I was like, wait, that Damn, really happened? Mom, happen. I just, stop, I just stop, thought stop, it was stop, a joke. Stop, 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 I thought stop, it was stop, a joke. Stop, stop, just stop, just stop. Just was... stop for a second. Just stop for a second. Just stop for a second. That's not weird to you <laughs> that, like, I be sharing, like, Life or death instances. <laughs> no, I thought that was a joke. Say, Yo, thought you was wilding to the homies. <laughs> yeah, told me. I thought you was joking. Cause who gets robbed right there in broad daylight? Joe, Joe. Button. <laughs> there you go. That's why I thought you was just talking shit. Until niggas confirmed it. Like, yeah, nah. Hey, Maul probably wore your chain. Didn't even know it. Maul knows the <laughs> niggas that robbed me. <laughs> nah, I, I don't know. Yo, I probably until do they know. told me. I mean, uh, somebody heard. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I heard up nah, the, nah. the yeah, no, I had him at Total. I didn't even know. <laughs> nah, nah. Nah, what, I what, know they, what, that was. what they told you? I didn't even come up. No, they just said, they was like, yo, Joe got robbed right there on her 45th. And I was like, wait, that really happened? I was like, because he told me, I always thought he was just joking. They're like, nah, yeah, they robbed I me. don't lie, you know. Like, when oh, I tell okay. these stories, I embellish a little bit, but yeah. I'm, I'm going to tell you what happened. Yeah, I thought it was a joke. I thought it was a joke. No, nah, man, did it say where the niggas went? <laughs> nah, I don't know who it was. <laughs> they know them? They, they Harlem niggas. They was young. Mm. Older niggas. They was uh, Should we talk about that? Shit? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 fuck it. You got God robbed. Damn. It happens. Oh, uh, no, nah, they was older. No, nah, I don't give a fuck about getting robbed. Yeah, that's... Uh, no, they was older. They was older. But I think what was happening at the time was it was a ring. It was like it was a, a ring of stick up kid niggas. And they was running, running around. Yeah. They was running around getting niggas, and they was uh they was melting it. But they was mel- they was melting it quick. Okay. Uh, so I think I I think I think, and I'm just I'm just talking shit. I could be totally off here. I didn't go searching for them to communicate. Uh, <laughs> Let's talk. Tell me why, man. But I think I think that they was just like headed out of town somewhere because it was hot at the time. Okay. Like they was finished. Mm-hmm. That's why only when you say who gets robbed right there, me. You were yeah. the last victim, bro. Daylight, yeah, they're probably they're, gonna be on the highway. Their, their robbing scheme, what they had, they it was suffice. Yeah, they <laughs> they were ready to go. All right, we've got everything we need. We out of here. Think niggas looked out the window and just seen me. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh but, shit, that's but, Joe right there on 145th and Lennox. Yeah, they're probably about to bust that two. right. Get on the highway. <laughs> go across yeah. the bridge. Get on quick. the Deegan. Yeah. Sam, Sam. <laughs> We got oh, one more to get. Yeah. Fam, because that is right by the highway. Yeah, right, right there. there. Right yeah, on the niggas came right right to me. But how you get robbed in front of your dad? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, I didn't know your pops was just... playing spades. Yeah, he's playing cards. Oh, okay. We playing cards. That's what we play. Cop right there on the corner directing traffic. Yo, you know what time it is. <laughs> Damn, that's the worst. It knows. Because the then you know what time and it is. And you know what time it is. Like, you know exactly. You should have like, oh, no, it's no, 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 three. no. Stop, stop, stop. But no, see, that's not true. That's not true. Let me give you a step by step, because when the nigga first say, "Do you know what time it is?" You might not know. Like you'll think for two seconds. You're like, "Oh, it's a." Uh- like when he did that and he did whatever he did, I thought for two seconds. Comp over there, daylight, bunch of people here. What are you doing? Nah, he might do it. <laughs> might you do you, it. you gotta serious? you gotta come to a conclusion, and then when you conclude, you know what time it is. Yeah, know what time it is. Yeah, I gave it up, man. Smart, smart. Yeah, you fucking right. Yeah. Fucking smart. Fuck that. Fucking. Just go fight him. No, but I did go over to the uh, to the projects shortly after, alone. Not so a smart move. It's a mistake. It's a mistake. <laughs> I know niggas over here. That nigga's long gone. Anyway, you get me sad now. Let me play off the <laughs> <laughs> no, That's not sad. That's just a moment. That's just, you know. Fam, I ain't sad. Everybody, Everybody gets robbed. Everybody gets. Listen, bro. if you tell me you never got robbed, if you it tell me outside. you never lost a fight, it if you tell outside. me you never got punched in the face, like, come outside. on. Yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm cool on that. They melted that chain down fast. Because <laughs> I think I eventually found the spot that melted it down. I just went to pawn shops. Hmm. And, and and then I say, yeah, no more chains. No, no more. The chains are attracting energy that I ain't looking for. Right. Like, 
Robert energy. I just stopped here to play a quick game of cards and head to Def Jam or something. <laughs> <laughs> Kaiser. Uh, all right. Uh, I think this is the right one. Ah! Joe, it's the one that all says right, no, six no, no, minutes. No, do it. Oh, yeah. Why don't I even play this three-minute bullshit? Yeah. Oh god damn it! And of course, you just read the album, 20th Century Remastered. Yeah, but you know but but sometimes they have good masterings on there, like that the uh, the like the redo of of Sade uh Sade shit that just came out. Oh yeah, it's the best mastering of her music. Hmm. Okay. I am gonna delete this though, because <laughs> enough is enough. Normally we'd be winding down. It's about halftime, goddamn. <laughs> Got a full list left. Hey! Hey, if it's too much talking like some of you new ass niggas complain about, you can always leave it and return. <laughs> Genius concept. <laughs> Wait, are there Press new pause, fans that are saying back. there's too much talking on a podcast? Sometimes. What should we be doing? Sometimes they say two and three hours hard for me to get through the casual podcast listeners. Oh, casual. Mm-hmm. Hey, mm-hmm. not the, the diehards. The people that didn't get us here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm with you. That's funny when you say it like that. Because the people that didn't get you here always got the most demand. Of course. <laughs> Word. I heard this record in two weeks. All right, where the fuck were we? We back, goddammit. What else is going on in the universe? Uh, let me think. Did we, we skipped over... Uh, we still got music left. Still got music. We uh, still have Young Buck versus the loser in Whole Foods. We have Damian <laughs> Lillard versus Marvin Bagley. We have the NBA draft. We have Maul signing AD to the Lakers. And my cap space jam theory that I have that I want to get into. We have Seinfeld and Eddie Murphy getting together. Tory Lanez and his colorist scandal. Dirk is out on bond. Uh, let me see. Biden stands with Zachary. Uh, huh? Dirk Nowitzki? Lil Dirk. Oh, okay. yeah, Lil, Lil Dirk. Dirk has a case. Lil Dirk. Uh, the Double XL freshman Dirk. cover. Uh, <laughs> well, Cute thing. Uh, let me see. Line of music. Mutual friend. So yeah, what do y'all want? What do y'all want to begin on this on this list here? Yo, before we before we segue to wherever we're going, let me let me say this. Uh, while we're off that uh, new music conversation with Nikki and Trina and, and just some of the women, I have been speaking to women, not like that. Relax. Women and men who make great songs that are making them for women now. So what I'm saying is, I think that was 2017. We made some, I made, we or I made some predictions in 2017 about 2019. And here we are. I said a bunch of niggas was going to die. That has happened, unfortunately. Uh, And I think I said the woman takeover would be happening. And we're witnessing it. My point and what I'm leading to here is, the tip of the iceberg. We ain't seen nothing yet. Still coming. There is a, an entire wave of strippers, bartenders, ghetto girls, attractive women, models that are coming with music. Yeah, no, I mean, happened right after the Cardi wave. Yeah, it's supposed to happen after the Cardi, after her success, but it's it's not gonna last. Shit. Some of them were good though. Yeah. And this is why, it's, but this is why it's scary, yeah, mom. But this is why it's it scary. And, and, and I be hearing that Chinese kitty listen. record and be like, "Damn, that shit is alright." Chinese <laughs> kitty shit is hard. Chinese <laughs> kitty shit is hard. <laughs> it's a re- bunch of them that's hard. Yeah. Yeah. I was listening to her shit like. Did y'all hear? Right. Did, did y'all hear uh, any of Ruchi shit yet? Who I bigged up, whatever that was. Nah, her yeah. shit is hard. Who? Fuck it, Ruchi. No, nah, I'm not hip. Renee Ruchi. Not hip. It's fine. We'll get to it. But it's a bunch of them. Uh, but this is where that's tricky, mom. In the entertainment business. Today, where image is so important, mm-hmm. all of these girls got all you niggas beat in image. Yeah. All of them. And, and, and the next one that they're going to come out with that I don't know yet. You got They got y'all beating image. Guess what? They all probably sound better than most of the new niggas, too, because women sound better. <laughs> yeah, sometimes. Yeah. And well, Im- like, image, I'll agree with you, obviously, because men love women and women love women to look at. Right. All women. There, there's very few men that like are just people want to look at all women. the time. <laughs> I think that women sound better than men too. So to what to what capacity? 
just sonically, just listening to them talk. Oh, well, I agree with you there. So if you get I'm one... I'm saying make, making so, rapping. So, so if you get one that can flip delivery and cadence and all... Uh, then you have like, Meg That could flip the guy. Whatever the guy is doing, right. if she could do it, that yeah. put her shit on it, right. of course. she gonna sound better than nigga. <laughs> yeah. I eat Meg right now. I'm saying these new niggas are gonna have it hard going up against the girls that are backed by people that can make records. Mm -hmm. I agree. But why is it that it seems like they always push the ratchet? Because that's just and, and don't naturally push, what and don't push happens. the That's what's working right now. The Easy win. Shit, the, the dope yeah. shit like Rhapsody. But she's pushed too, so I'm not going to say that. I don't think she's pushed halfway as near. She's pushed by the somebody. right people that matter in that world. She, yeah, she, she's Her pushed, album did well. Real well. Yeah. I'm not real saying well. it did, but I'm just saying, I don't think she's... I don't think she gets half the push. I, I get what Moe is saying. She don't want half yeah. that push. Yeah, right. She she's don't getting, want a, half she's getting that away push. from that push. I'm sure she probably wants that push, but not she the same kind. No, no, no. I don't. Not, not yeah. the, I, I'll tell y'all for a fact, she don't want that push. Yeah. She don't want that push. <laughs> yeah. She don't. Would she like to be pushed? Yes. Right. Certain people. She not doing all. Yeah, rap. She ain't doing all that. She don't rap. But uh, I don't know. I just think it's, it's fucked up. If I was a new act, I'd be scared to death. If I were a new artist having to survive in this climate, back to that conversation that we always have about, I would be scared. To death right now, honestly, it's spooky to me. Anyway, whatever. And the girls new, are killing it. And a new, new artist. Yeah. yeah, I'm looking forward to hearing the girls. I'm gonna keep them. listening and looking. <laughs> I'm about to go write a 16 for Stephanie Santiago right now. I got a, I got a trick for these niggas. You think Steph wouldn't kill a little quick eight? Shake some ass. I would listen. <laughs> right, you do more. <laughs> How do you guys feel about I'm Dirk's joking. case? I'm <laughs> joking. Uh, Dirk in and out. In our, in our rappers under, in our, what's our segment that we started and never started and never did again? Rappers under 25 or people under 25 or shit that we don't care about under 25. Either way, Dirk went to jail. I care about Lil Dirk. I like Lil Dirk's music. Right, and I think he's over 25 at this point. Yeah, I think he Yeah, is. Dirk should be over 25. Yeah, yeah. Dirk might be 30. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dirk started out younger than me and then passed me in age. Yeah. <laughs> Dirk turned himself in and uh, uh, that seemingly went a long way and they allowed him to bond out 250 grand. Uh, so he's out. Good for him. Yeah. Yeah, let me hit a round of applause because that's great. Yeah. I guess the unsettling part was they said they have video evidence of him shooting. So I don't know where they're going to go with that, but that's just what I read. Well, if you have it, then don't, don't tell me. That's, That's the I'm, other part. If you have it, then, then, then great. You're going to go to court and you're going to show that and then Dirk will have a hard time. Until then, don't try, don't stop trying niggas' cases in, in public opinion. Mm. Stop trying to get me to think a certain way before you give a verdict. No, you go yeah. figure out how, how you should be thinking They're and then give me right. a verdict. They're always going to do that. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah. Um, what I will say, speaking of uh, verdicts and shit, I know we all we all talked about when they see us that uh, Ava DuVernay uh, Netflix. We talked about it up and down every which way. Did, did any of y'all see the uh, the Oprah? I was about to ask you the Oprah interview. Yeah, I did. That was phenomenal. I didn't see it. I was crying literally. You have a different. Yeah, you have a, it. Make it gives you a different. Uh, and as great as that, as great as that series was, watching that Oprah shit gave me a whole different outlook. And yes. I, I cried. Yeah. Um, hearing from the men, though. Yes. That's what did it. Yeah. Two of them is really fucked up. Yes. Like, like uh, why, Corey Wise. Yes. Corey definitely looks like he's he, not all there. I yeah. felt, I felt, I, f I feel, I feel yeah. for him. I feel for him. And, and as amazing of a job as the actor did that, that played him, because they all, we all praised him and the job he did. Seeing Corey Wise currently just had it like, Oh, it, it was hard. It's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. Mm -hmm. And 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 the really big, big, big dude who who was up there saying, "Yo, I need therapy. Therapy. I'm fucked up. I hate everybody. Uh, I hated society. As soon as I heard guilty, I went to jail. Got muscles. Developed <laughs> anger issues. And just started pounding niggas out. Like he was saying, I'm fucked up. Fuck my dad. Never want to see hear hear from you. Fuck. Like it just gave me a whole different. I might go watch. Watch the series again now with, that with I that have. Line. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was it was that deep. So if you have not seen it, this is not an ad. I encourage you to go see it. Trust me. I, I DM. I think it was Anton. I, the, that's his name. Yeah, the guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, enc I encourage anybody to go see it. Uh, and it's on Netflix. It's on Netflix. Mm -hmm. uh, check it out. Speaking of more shit on Netflix, uh, 
Seinfeld announced his the the next the next batch of uh, comedians sip coffee in cars or comedians in cars getting coffee. Yes, there yes. we go. And great lineup, but Eddie Murphy's name jumped off of that thing to me. That show is phenomenal. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Like that's one of my go tos is. when I'm just like, you know what? I want to just watch this shit, man. It's content done correctly, bro. It's great. That shit is phenomenal. There's so much jewels, even in like the mm-hmm. people that you're not cars? familiar. Yeah. Oh yeah, of course. That's yeah. All of it. Is Love it. that show. Yeah. Yeah, but Seinfeld. it has replay value too. Seinfeld yeah, I'll rewatch and episodes. Eddie, Absolutely. Watch. Seinfeld and Eddie. Seinfeld is be and Eddie Murphy. Seinfeld because Eddie, Eddie doesn't though. sit down with anybody. That's true. No, you, you don't, don't hear you don't from Eddie. Shit, yeah. half of the a lot of the comedians on there don't sit with people. Yeah, word. No, 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 no. Okay. I get, well, I get where Eddie is a different. <laughs> he's over is, here. He's yeah. Hollywood royalty. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. But Eddie is he's, Eddie ho- he's Hollywood royalty. That's one of my favorite shows. I actually think it was probably easier for Jerry to get Obama than it was to get Eddie on that <laughs> shit. And I'm not saying that as a joke. I genuinely mean that. Yeah. No, I agree. Yeah, I agree. He, he I agree with be. you on that. No, Obama on Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> He's on. That's what started it out. Yeah, you know what I mean, get his, you know, I did comedians in cars. I see the Joe Button podcast. I could do this. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't wait to see Seinfeld and Eddie Murphy. I don't even care what they talk about. It don't matter. I don't give a fuck what they. They used to be kicking it. Yeah, that's all that's gonna be. Yeah. All right. So yeah, I'm, I'm really, I'm really looking forward. Really I just recently watched. That. Actually, on the plane back, because I really watch them shits all the time. The Tracy Morgan one, <laughs> they sit in the car, and <laughs> Tracy, this was not a generally ass Seinfeld. Yo, you remember Kramer? <laughs> <laughs> Kramer? Seinfeld looked over like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do. I remember him. <laughs> Tracy's great. Too. Seinfeld, I never want to talk about that Kramer, you know. Now, he had Kramer on the show. And uh, they they covered all that shit up uh, on Kirby Enthusiasm. They did some shit with Leon... Uh, oh yeah, and Kramer doing all that shit. They addressed it. Yeah. Larry more addressed it than Seinfeld. But yeah. now they talked about that shit on the um, comedians and cars, if I remember correctly. Oh, I would like to. I'd like to see that. Yeah, yeah, I would like to see that. How do I find? How do I search for that? It's on Netflix. It's, it's all on Netflix. Browse through the uh, what, which episode? Some, some surf. The Kramer. Uh, Richard. The Kramer. What's yeah. his name? Uh, something Richard. I forgot his real name. Something Richard. Kramer. He's, yeah. he's Kramer. See him, yeah. He looks Kramer. Kramer. All right, got it. I'll go. I'll go search for that. Yeah. Um. All right. What else? What else? What else? What else is important? Oh, God damn it. See? See? My fucking short-term memory in this long break. I almost forget very important things. And y'all, I get disappointed in y'all sometimes. Like, I'm mad at Rory that he tried to uh, get me to come to L.A. but didn't tell me it was BT weekend down there. He knows <laughs> I wouldn't go to L.A. if it was BT weekend down well, there. Of course. Yeah, that's why I would leave it out. That was kind of swaggy of you and Maul. <laughs> I, like, I like that one. But that's yeah, one. BT and weekend. two... Y'all tried to get me to y'all tried to get me to forget that Chance is a comedian now. Chance the comedian? Chance, I didn't know he was a comedian. Chance, Chance, Chance the comedian. Chance. Slash rapper. Well, I saw the Doritos commercial with Backstreet Boys. I thought that was comedy. Turn like a taco <laughs> oh, wait, the ta- nacho. I gotta hear the set. <laughs> Time out. I want to get right back to Chance. But back to another prediction of mine being right. I told y'all last year that Chris Paul and James Harden was going to kill each other. Now, <laughs> that's not why I'm bringing it up. Why I'm bringing it up is... I know the petty in Chris Paul is mad that he got James Harden and the mother Rockets the State Farm gig. <laughs> <laughs> this was I put y'all on. This how y'all pay me back. This was my uh, thing. honestly, Maul. Give us a scoop on that. Come on, what, what, what what's, down, what's really happening? What are they saying in the group chats? In State Farm. What's what's Chris and Cliff? <laughs> <laughs> what are those two saying? <laughs> yeah, come on, Maul. What Chris told you. Uh, I, I mean, I think it's or just... Or Cliff, uh, if you're closer with him. I they love just that don't... Maul does come right in with a breakdown or whatever he's <laughs> saying. No, I, I think that they really just... It's, it's just... It, I don't know if it's a personal thing or they just feel like, I don't want to... We just need to break this they, up. They Chris is the, getting they, older. They, they called the Knicks and offered Chris. And I, and I, I was mad that the niggas just hit the Knicks to see if they're intelligent still. <laughs> like, it don't be a proper it don't be a proper trade request. Right. It'd be, yo. We hey. know y'all be doing some dumb <laughs> shit. <laughs> that, that, that's all niggas. How you feel about this? That's all they hit the Knicks about. The yeah. Knicks didn't Nick this year. But back to Chance the Comedian. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I want, I, I'm going to crack on him because that's what we do here. We're doing a podcast, but... I, I've always wanted to do that too. <laughs> uh, Blake Griffin did it, and it was pretty funny. But Blake Griffin is funny for real. Blake, yeah, Blake, uh, Comedy Store, one of them spots in LA. Hmm. I saw a set; it was funny. Yeah, he did that a few you years. Said Chance it. You went said up. it on the set. Chance, uh, you said no, I, wa- it? I watched it. You know, Festival YouTube. Poppy was at the set. Yeah. First of all, so he, he, I love Blake's doing the set. Yeah, you know, you, you know, he got an alert. <laughs> of course, for the Comedy <laughs> for the, Store, for the, I'm for in the, there for the Blake set. Um, 
No, fucking Chance went up there and he did a set. He did a set at the Laugh Factory in Chicago. I'm not reading any facts, so if I'm wrong, just whatever. No, you're correct. You're correct. Uh, he did a set at the Laugh Factory, right? And I thought where he was going with his set was pretty good. He was talking about the the, the proverbial uh, black people cookout that we always talk about and mm-hmm. invite people to, and that what that's what it was centered around. So he's saying, why do we invite people? Like, it's going to be a horrible cookout. He said, like, it's going to be white people playing spades. Like, he was getting, <laughs> like, but they wasn't they wasn't giving it up. I thought he was pretty good. I thought it was funny, mm-hmm. but it was chance. You saw the set somewhere? Or did he like just? No, it was just clips. Okay, it, somebody, it, somebody sent me the clip. I, I didn't watch it though. Got it. I watched it because I watched it, and um, uh, it was pretty good. It, it wasn't bad. I thought that he deserved a little more laughter from the crowd. But they don't know how to take you if you're not a comedian and you're on stage. Right. Yeah, they don't know. If, they like, don't know. Yeah, they're like, what's make... happening right now? Yeah. Plus, yeah, he's, yeah. you got to learn how to deliver. That part. That's, like, like, yeah. that's, that's stage, an art form. Stage presence is much different. When that's you're, an art form. I think stand-up comedy is, is probably one of the harder art forms. Yeah, and maybe number one. Being up there by yourself. <laughs> like, that's a different type of monster. Yeah, you got a music to dance to. And, and not knowing what people feel like laughing at. Yeah. That's, that's funny. I think all of the art forms are that. Yeah. I think every single art form, if you give it to somebody that don't do it, is that. Well, I agree. But <laughs> like try to get me to do some to draw. But it's different when it's not collaborative. Yeah. <laughs> but it would be like a non comedian getting on stage in front of some people trying to do some shit. Like, yeah, but, give but, me but a I paintbrush. think but I think all right, if you if you try to get me to break dance. I'll put it this way. Right. If you have a sheet of music You rap. You sing like no Any doubt. at all. No doubt. I think I think rapping and stand up comedy are similar in that aspect, but give me a sheet of music and put a piano up piano player up there. If they can follow that sheet of music and play that, it that's exactly what they're supposed to do. If you give someone a joke, give me the same joke as say a Dave Chappelle, it's not gonna be funny coming from me because I'm not a comedian. I don't have to deliver it that way. Chappelle is funny. Got if it. you give me the same sheet music and I know how we'll to play, play the piano, it. right. it's gonna sound exactly the same. Well, no it's not, but I see what you're saying. I understand yeah, what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. That's but why I, I think I comedy is a bit have, different. I wouldn't have made that correlation. I'm not a rapper, but I can definitely go on stage and rap right now. <laughs> 100%. Maybe not my own music, but like I can take well, somebody's lyrics and that, rap them. That wouldn't be the art. It is the art. People do it all the time. It's called karaoke. They win awards it's too karaoke. when they do it. It's karaoke. <laughs> no, it's artists. Let's that, do rap karaoke. It's artists that don't write their own shit. All right, well, let's do it. Bust, bust, bust it out right now. You got the beat on, my nigga. I don't do Acapulco. Oh, no, no. <laughs> what? I have an iTunes full. <laughs> what, <are you> about? <laughs> what is he talking about? Wait right there. <laughs> don't move. Give him shook ones. Yeah, what the fuck is he talking yeah. about? Anybody you need, can you need rap some water? Yeah, I know what about to see. Yeah, you, know, you, can rap, you never <laughs> rap the shook <laughs> ones? <laughs> Come on, that's a cheat code. You can't give me shook ones, Well, cheat, nigga. <laughs> what you want? What you want? 12 on that? No, nah, I want the full 16. Pause, turn my beat up. The Grand Concourse, you know me, I'm on course. Oh, no, 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 Never horse, you know, hey, come on, I'm all Never go. horse. Hey. Nah. I got to cock it back for more, come on. Nah. Wait, I'm let me treat, let me treat more like, like, like Swiss, like Swiss no, used to do. Course. Cassidy the monster. We're not finished. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> we're not done. <laughs> Young Maul. Taking on all challengers. What if Cassidy was done though? <laughs> like you know, yo, about that. what if Cassidy like you? That's all. Look, I look got, how he so. got out of that. Word. Go ahead. Yeah, he talked his way out. Maul is good to get a joke and get out of the situation. I don't rap. I will never forgive Cassidy for. I'm gonna battle Cassidy one day. I will never <laughs> forgive him and Swiss for how they attempted to do stack bundles. On Clues Monday Night Mixed. I, I'm telling you, I was listening to my radio. Niggas lucky I don't rap no more. I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God, okay. I ain't even talk about it. But Sidetrack, I finally watched that Cassidy Goods battle. Go ahead. Me too, Cass lost. He did. Big time. Don't uh, Some people feel like he won. No. He, he's he some didn't. people. Cass is in a different generation. <laughs> no, you know what the problem is? When niggas, like, when when niggas like me do battle rap, when niggas like Cass do battle rap, when niggas with fans not from battle rap bring their fans to battle rap, it's annoying. Move. <laughs> 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 like... Why are Cassidy fans in here? To, hey, goods, you didn't do it. You don't even know Goods. <laughs> you have no idea who Goods is. Yeah, that, right. that's what it, it just makes it saturate, yeah, saturates. As you were saying, it a little I just wanted, I finally watched it. So go ahead. What was I saying? I don't remember. Maul doing karaoke. I don't know. Maul was supposed to give us. I don't a, care about Maul doing karaoke. No, we oh, about. that's what we do. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh. Come on, Dunny. Uh, yo. Come on, Dunny. Yo. 
Uh, from the concourse, you know me, no, I'm on course. No, Voice number no. horse. Uh, uh, hey, yo. You took that course and just ran with it, flipped the four-way. Hey, hey, uh, yeah. Who you know gonna sell you the whole pack? You gonna smoke man, something man, to come man. <laughs> You gonna smoke something to come right back? <laughs> who you know that's gonna sell you the whole pack? Yeah. No, who do you know? Yo, with Mo, niggas, yo, yo that's yo, why I don't fuck with Joe, yo. Joe be trying that's to paint this narrative about me. That's why I, sell you the whole pack. That's why I hate rappers. Right because back. if you would have said that in a convincing way, it would have been it would have sounded hot. But anyone that would sell drugs would sell you the whole pack. <laughs> who you know? Like that's yo, why I hate rappers. Yo, when a rapper says, "Who you know? Who you know? Yeah, who you know?" Oh, he always man. talking about himself. Yeah, the nigga's only talking about himself. Who you know? You who, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why we thought that was the dopest shit. <laughs> who you know? Who you, you know? Got nigga? the block on. Li- you're, 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 you're you. The first you're the you. There's a lot of blocks too. Oh. <laughs> More different. Come on, I was. I threw a lot of who you knows in there. Of course, <laughs> who you know. Who you, you from know. the who you know era? I am so trash. <laughs> Joe might have started who you know. Him or Kiss. Him or nah, Kiss. It was Kiss. It was, oh, kiss. Right. it was Kiss. 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 Well, no, I don't know if Kiss started it, but when I started doing it. I got it from Kiss. From Kiss. Okay. <laughs> I got it from Kiss. When I said uh, I was uh, moving weight from a Palm Pilot. Yeah. Just flipping some Kiss shit. Yeah. <laughs> I, couldn't even, kiss I shit. couldn't even work my Palm yeah. Pilot. <laughs> that shit had to pin on the side. Palms was trash. Palm Pilot was trash. Yeah, was Yo, Palm Pilot was terrible. It was Very horrible. inefficient way to sell the blow. Yeah. <laughs> like, you're you not moving no weight from your Palm Pilot. Shut the fuck up, Joe Budden. <laughs> I see why nigga said he was trash. Um... <laughs> Still waiting for the A. Yeah, I'm 12. not leaving this. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> hey, who you know? Come on. Y'all niggas go, course. Nah. You know me. At least give us a good warm up. Like, uh, uh, yo. You know me from the choir. I stopped singing. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, now I just give you fire. Now I'm on Ooh. dire. Uh, Nobody knows for hire. Mm. Whole block wired. Come to me. Hey. Nobody knows uh, the uh, choir. Catch me, catch uh, me on dire. And you know no. the gun. <laughs> not more. Now I'm Rasheed Sunflower. <laughs> nigga, t- yeah, come on. Get more. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are fucking stupid. You don't hear Roy. I'm on dire. <laughs> you been on dire. Why though? do you know that block, Roy? Hey, hey, <laughs> hey, I know that block. Too. Hey. <laughs> Y'all niggas are stupid. Oh man, man. he's not gonna give us that verse. It's cool though. Nah. <laughs> all right, come on, Parks. <laughs> you, you, you got. You got to give it to us. That, all right. I'm straight. All right. Straight from uh-huh. the concourse. I need the knee you high Levi. C Y me guy. I need the knee high C. Knee high Levi's. Joe is corny. I need the knee high Levi's. No, Rory got bars. Yeah. I, I gave I gave the bars to more. Yeah, I, I added in the dia out there. He threw dia out yeah. there. I need the knee. I, I need Levi's. Levi's. What does that even mean? C-Y. I, I think he threw a C-Y yeah. in there. Ra- really, yo, no, he rappers love the C-Y. They uh, wait for the, the whole mm. pause in the beat. C-Y. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, Parth, go ahead. I'm with my girl. We on Remy. <laughs> 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 you know he going to sneak in a, a Remy line. Yeah, yeah. Parth's going to tell you what he's drinking I'm for in. sure. He got to yeah. tell you what he's drinking. Then he try to, you know, when like rappers pretend to get confused. Wait, no, I'm in Remy. <laughs> No, no, get it drunk off Remy. <laughs> Yo, y'all, no. are, y'all are stupid, man. No. Y'all are no, fucking Roy stupid. Roy might have been a little fire. <laughs> yeah. Wait, no, me. wait, no. Drunk off Remy. Y'all are stupid, yeah. man. Uh, Yo, whenever rappers used to confuse themselves on purpose, <laughs> it was the greatest <laughs> shit in the world. The fake confusion? Remember when Hove tried to tell us the 76 floors was a dock? But the doc play for the 76ers? Yeah. <laughs> One day we're going to have a talk about all the times that Hove tried to confuse us. <laughs> no, yeah, and left us confused for a few, I was confused. few years. <laughs> it's like, how did they catch a freeze off his kneecap exactly? Yo. <laughs> that was, can I have a... Holy shit. <laughs> and nobody kicked the verse. <laughs> nobody. <laughs> Niggas just throwing just random my balls out there. Dying to rap. <laughs> you you trying to catch back. the bug. Yeah. <laughs> Joe trying to get the bug. He don't do that. Come on, bad. All right. Uh, oh, all right. Speaking of rap, wait. Were we done with Chance the comedian? 
yeah. Chance the Comedian oh, Rapper. Man. Yeah, Chance the Comedian Rapper saved somebody from a burning car. I don't know what the fuck. Zebra fish. Zebra fish. Zebra fish. Zebra fish. Zebra fish farm. That's the Yo. key. That's the key to all this. I need that whole rap part <laughs> sent, to, sent to my phone. <laughs> like, ASAP. Yeah, what's your Duce bar, though? Huh? What's his, What's your Duce bar? It's been a lot of Duce bars Ducé? that we're taking. Y'all gotta write that one for me. I don't care what your crew say if they ain't do say. No, I, no, 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 I don't they, like, no. Oh, if they don't do, the if they don't do what they say. But, Rory, <laughs> but don't do that. Rory is disgusting. But stop. <laughs> don't do that part because Rory wouldn't rap to this beat. Come on, don't do that. Let's find a different beat for you. Don't beat Rory. I know, <laughs> some R and B shit. Yeah, ah, come on. Put the emotions <laughs> on. The emotionals. Yeah, come on, man. Come give it to him. <laughs> <laughs> I would kill this. <laughs> no, we know. Uh, Come on, let me let you me hear my voice. <laughs> Come here, you smoky black. <laughs> Get on your smoky black, Rory. <laughs> Wait, that was funny. <laughs> Get on your smoky black. Uh, Parks, I'm about to say, say, don't my tune nah, on, don't my tune all, on. Wait, don't do that, don't do that. Hold up, no, let we me do it. We need that effect. Don't on you this try podcast. to make it cool. Let me bring this back. Because Rory is the nigga that's going to talk in front of his. Yo, how many you said you got with you? Four. <laughs> <laughs> How many? I, I can only do three. Now. I what can only you, do three. What time you trying to come? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little tight, yeah. but I'll make it happen. Tell me up and have fun. <laughs> Rory, get on that. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, stop. Because that's another shit, rappers. Don't pretend to have a conversation. Go, oh, wait, I was recording a song. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's, that's shut Big the fuck that's up. Turn me up. up. That's Biggie fault. I'm that blaming, is Biggie's I'm blaming, fault. I'm blaming Biggie for that. Come on, what, what Rory giving him? We got to move on, but Rory got to give him something. Just tell me what his verse is about. I'm gonna try it. <laughs> nah, he's doing it right now. Tennessee kind of enemies. You can get in your Tupac bag. Ooh, I could. I feel like Rory would try to give him classy bars like Drake do now. Like Rory would be Rory's rich. Rory's not classy, but he would give him rich bars. I don't uh, know anything rich though. I only take, <laughs> only drink do say neat. Only if you a freak. Mm. Okay. Look at Sam safe. trying to see if he's gonna throw some cheating bars in there. Or like, Why are you saying? Yo, I ain't y'all got Sam. Yo, <laughs> bitches galore. I got him at the door. Yeah. Like, whoa, 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 Sam, relax. It's just a Ginger joke, music. Sam. Yo, we can't. Yeah, forget it. We can't even play with Rory. We can't play with Rory. Don't do that. My chill, man, chill. Forget, forget it, man. She won't have an engagement yeah. party. She's all right. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot wife he was here, Rory. Yeah, yeah. We didn't know. We didn't know. All right. Um. I don't even want to hear say Vaughn verse. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, STD, she passed to see me. <laughs> she passed to see me. Uh, she in Miami. I'm in Miami too. And I'm bored to death. What you trying to do? I it's got my dude. brother with me. And he a wild dude. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Hold up, man. Turn this up. That's some nasty uh, raps, man. <laughs> I don't know what type of I don't uh, know this say is Save on the dawn Come hang I won't do you no harm <laughs> Got my brother with me Jameson Wild Whiskey Come and get away Wild Whiskey No way no. Jameson Wild, wild Whiskey, whiskey. <laughs> It's a wild night Alright Alright no Yo I don't ever want to talk to the chicks That want to come ja- when you say I got Wild Jameson. Whiskey <laughs> wild, wild Whiskey, whiskey. <laughs> It's Wild Whiskey in here Fuck you talking oh, about yeah, Listen Cuba Gooding Jr. He's <laughs> losing his he mind been at- Acting a fool. That nigga did the old. No, I mean, <laughs> say that one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's been losing his mind. We I hope he's all right. Bars, but it's cool. It's Spanish. We don't speak Spanish that fluently. <laughs> oh, shit. Damian Lillard versus Homeboy. That's what I wanted to talk about uh, real quick. Mm. Uh, I like basketball beef. Basketball, I like basketball beef. beef. I like that. I didn't know that Marvin Bagley the third had bars. <laughs> It don't sound like a rapper name. At all. <laughs> and I'm not expecting no nigga that went to Duke to have bars. Ever. Uh, but he wasn't bad, Marvin Bagley. Yeah. I, what position he play? Uh, I think like the three. Four. Oh, okay. So he's four. Is he be, a four? He's not be going head, head to head like a three, pause four. with Dame. Uh, listen, we never talk about the Kings have to regret that pick. <laughs> Which one? Marvin Bagley. Uh, Why? Because he just went off the two. Verse? Oh. Yeah, but He I mean, went and, two and then, and then Trey Young went. And then Luca went. And then, uh, so who else went dope? Like, he went two or three. Yeah. I mean, and then niggas start going ham after if you, him. If you had the chance to get Luca, you fucked up. Yeah. And Trey. But they had a, they got De'Aaron Fox over there. So they didn't need They true, wasn't looking true. for a point yeah. guard. Yeah, that's true. Um, no, did you hear? Did anybody hear? Did y'all no, hear Marvin's? Yet. I ain't listening yet. No, I didn't hear either. Who won? All right. Well, no, no, no. We got to play some of it at least. Give me the thing. Because 
I'm not gonna do Marvin Bagley. How, well, how did this battle or quote beef start? Marvin Bagley the third was on first take. Yeah. Okay. Max that. Kellerman bullshitting around said a, a fan of because the there's nothing to talk about when there's no sports. So he said, "Yo, do you feel like you're the best?" Baller rapper, and he said, "Yeah, of course." And then Max said, "Well, do uh, you think you're better than Dame?" Mm-hmm. And it looked like it was a compromising question, but he said, "Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, I'm better than him, and we can do it wherever. We can do it right here." Not, no, Max not said that. Max, that. Max said that. Not knowing Let that you play basketball in Hoboken. <laughs> Max said, "Yeah, maybe y'all could battle on first take." <clears throat> Marvin Bagley said, "Cool." Damian Lillard must have seen it and immediately went to the studio. I'm not playing with y'all. <laughs> right. Word. I'm headed to the studio now. It's the off season. And by the time the draft was on, I had bars. <laughs> <laughs> that's dope. <clears throat> and that's why I fuck with Dame. Because you can hit a 40-footer and give a nigga about a quick 40 just, just on a whim. And just but Dame can rap. But he started it... <laughs> Just how he started his grown man bars. Something you got to deal with. <laughs> like, he was talking he, he, he to rappers Rex. before he started rapping. Right. So, I mean, who you think we siding with? Uh, let me try to find this this Marvin Bagley shit real quick because I don't think anybody here knows But Marvin that. Bagley is more, his 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 music is more uh, like on a, turn, on a side of like Lecrae type of vibe. He's okay. like Christian like, shit? Yeah, he's more like one of them more type Sunday of... service. Uh, I mean, Lecrae got bars, Is, is so. that what happened? Because... More Rasheed Flowers. This, this guy didn't sound like... <laughs> it's like more like... motivational rap. Oh, no. Okay. See, this is Dame right. right here. Yeah, let me turn Dame up real quick, man. Dame. You still owe Dame a verse, Positive right? rap. You owe, you owe Dame a verse. Some, something you got to deal oh. with. Woo. Gave him the duppy. This nigga called my name. <laughs> Basketball rap beef. This is great. Sorry, buddy. Uh oh. Oh, uh, he about to bug out. Here it comes. <clears throat> uh, now he bugging. Get your shit off. <coughs> what Marvin said. Listen, you think man. this is better than the Kobe versus Shaq rap battle? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing will ever be better than that. <laughs> yeah, you stupid. <laughs> Did we ever really get all of uh, rounds from that battle? <laughs> no, I right? I think it was a one and one. <laughs> <laughs> Just left it at that? Yeah. I think after Kobe hit record, I didn't think we needed anything else after that. <laughs> Oh, I thought it was over after uh, Kobe tell me how my ass tastes. Ooh, when he gave him that dialogue. Oh, that, that response at the club? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Shaq went crazy. <laughs> yeah, at, at the club. I don't want to hear that at the club. <laughs> Young Marv. Young Marv. <laughs> Marv. <clears throat> I like the beat. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> I don't know, man. 
I don't know. <laughs> Marvin bags threes. Nah. 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 But don't, that, that don't, be, but don't that act be, like Marvin ain't do his thing, though. That beat that 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 carries. You sound all right. I, I think it's... <clears throat> he about to break him down. All right. <laughs> this this just established that I don't need basketball rap beef. It's cool. Really? I'm not mad at it. I don't need I, had, it. I thoroughly enjoyed this. <laughs> I don't need that it. That was cool. I don't Dame, need it. Dame, cool. Dame raps better though. I don't know. I think that if, if Marvin shit was turned up a little bit, his shit was a little better. lost in that off, beat. His, uh, his, his bounce was a little... His, he had a, beat yeah, was a his flow was a little better. But what Dame was saying is better shit though. I don't yeah. know where the headphones Maybe so. They're attached to a cord. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Rory. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Let's see if Damian Lillard's phone number's the same. <laughs> okay. Uh, he had I'm to change it. After uh, that? No, I wouldn't know. Yeah, uh, Marvin. Kept calling. <laughs> you think he changed it? He had to. Can't keep using the same number. And who said he's going to answer your, <laughs> your shit? No, I, I, I never know that when I call. You don't speak. Get off speaker. Oh, shit. Hmm. Come on. Come on, Dame. Give it to me. <laughs> You're not answering a random number Come without a text prior. Answer no phone, buddy. It's Joe. <laughs> <laughs> You're sick. Come on, it's Budden. <laughs> it's your old pal. This is what you do Hi. every time he calls someone. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, it's your, it's your old pal, Joe. <laughs> Just answer. Come on, it's uh, Joe. <laughs> Come on, it's me. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm giving that to Dame, even though I did appreciate, I appreciate it, Marv. I did. I'm cool well, basketball yeah. rap beef, but I do think Dame can rap. That was my first time hearing. They both rapped Marv. pretty well. Listen, anytime. Uh, I'm just a fan of dudes uh, with rapid fire responses. Yeah, yeah. I'm with that, you. I'm, I'm, I'm always a fan of that. Like I'm with you. for y'all to do this during the draft, <laughs> like the NBA draft. <laughs> They're already is drafted. On. That's dope. Yeah, no. Let these little niggas know what they coming into. <laughs> <laughs> no. Let them know. It was dope. Uh, listen, I'm going to say this, and we're going to end this podcast soon. But, well, no, I want more to give us some type of some type of uh, expert analysis on the draft and at least some of the NBA happenings that, that have occurred since we've been gone. And I want to start with the Anthony Davis signing. I want to congratulate Maul for getting that deal done and I getting tried, Anthony man, Davis you know, to the Lakers. I had to do what I had to do. Now the Lakers don't have cap space to get up uh, whatever it is. I don't know what the fuck y'all trying to do, but y'all ain't got no money. I thought they had a little bit of money left. We're we'll gonna make a few moves to get that. I they had a little twenty five or something. It ain't yeah. enough for a max. They got enough to spread out somewhere and just fill the rest of their team out. But with this cap space problem that they're saying that they have, nobody's gonna nobody's gonna talk about maybe LeBron funneling money from some of his other entities to bring over to the Lakers for cap space so they could do what they gotta do. Like we'll never find that out. But is LeBron taking some of the space jam money and signing niggas over to the Lakers, man? No. Well no, even if you have side money, how does that work in a cap space? What is he gonna well, no, he give can say, them a I'm gonna put this you person will make this amount of money, but you really make it. No, I'm going to put you on the shop. I'll give you $5 Every, million yeah. this season. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Everybody yeah. I okay. know that with multiple businesses like that they run and control budgets for, all they do is yeah. just just grab just and switch and yeah. funnel and finagle. So why wouldn't I think that one of the best businessmen on the planet doesn't do the same? I'm sure he's doing something. Because like at 34, 35 years old, trying to win a chip for a <clears> team <throat> without much cap space, and I got all of this fucking ancillary money over here. Mm-hmm. No. The NBA is bigger than LeBron. No, it ain't. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Okay. But who's to say? Well, why why is, is the NBA to say he can't put someone on the shop? For and how would they know? Yeah. How would they know if if him and uh, somebody go to dinner and say, "Yo, just take the short, man. I got you. It's, it's, I'll wire it." Niggas ain't doing that. <laughs> All right, fine. I that's, listen. That's not real. It's not. It's not for me to stay here. I'm just talking shit and trying to bring yeah. some compelling content. No, to a play, podcast. players. I think players. What happens is players will take uh, less money. Be if they believe that this team has a legit shot of really. Do you think that the Lakers have a legit shot now? Uh, playoffs. Do you think that Cal Kuzma is fucking Genie Bus? 
No. <laughs> no, I don't know why you think that. I, I never said I thought that. See, that's how I get in trouble. I no, but I said something. no, and you, you rolled your eyes like, how do I not think that? No, I, I, rolled, I rolled my eyes like, have, how have you not at least even thought about it or heard it? No? I know I've heard it, but that's just stupid talk. Because NBA players have never fucked. No, but it's... You're not going from Ketcha to Genie Bus. Shit. I'm with that. Yeah. <laughs> no. But they, they, they yes, need you shooters. Are. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fucking catch your end. Sugar mama over here that <laughs> owns the Lakers. What are you talking about? <laughs> no. no, uh, no. No, don't touch me. Yeah, no. That's what you think is happening? Yeah. All right, I got it. They still need shooters, though. We need shooters. We have no fucking shooters on the team. Uh, all right, so you feel better about your team? It's looking up. They paid a lot, though. Yeah, they, I we, gave, we got, I think yeah, we I'm overpaid. I'm trying to give, get into a quick breakdown and get out. Yeah. Don't make uh, more. I think, I think we uh, overpaid. But the Pelicans... Came out great. <laughs> they really did. Pelicans came out great. Uh, Cal Corver uh, stood up against racism, and Utah shipped his ass out of there on the first thing smoking. <laughs> Wait, what? I mean, what did he say? Oh, and I meant to call <laughs> you. What happened? I meant to call you during the draft. They when, got, uh, Utah guy, Cal Corver said, listen, I've never been for white people treating black people. It's like, yeah, all right. <laughs> Time to go. Like? Yeah. Utah. Yeah, get him out of here. What you about to call me for? What you say? Um, when when Chauncey was breaking down Zion at the draft, and one of the players, he, Julius Randle, I told you, he was like, "Nah, no way." He said a lot of nut shit up there too. Uh, most of it should be spot on. There was a couple where I was like, huh? "I want somebody from Charlotte to explain to me y'all draft choices every year." <laughs> every year they draft the same person. Didn't they draft Mal Bridges? Miles Bridges, somebody last year, and now they draft a different version mm-hmm. of Bridges this mm-hmm. year. Whatever, I, mean, I won't get into it. But uh, I enjoy. I thoroughly enjoyed the draft. Happy the Knicks didn't nick. There's nothing else for me to really talk about. Go Lakers. Uh, what, what 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 do you got? Lakers are going to be bad, but I mean it's a start. Everybody trying to uh, pony up to win the chip now that uh, KD is hurt. That, that's what that's it looks fact. like. Yeah, change the landscape. I do like that Mike Conley to Utah move. They're not contenders, but I like it. I do like Bo Bo uh, to uh, Denver. Yeah. I don't think they're contenders, but I like it. Um, you don't contenders. like Conley? You don't like Conley to Utah? Those are I like both, it. Both oh, those teams are contenders, by the way. I said I like it a lot. I don't yeah, think I th- so. I think there's, Utah there's, is there's very contenders, and there's teams that are that are really ready for prime time. I don't think Denver or uh, Utah are ready for prime time yet. The Lakers aren't ready for prime time yet. Shit, they're not. Yeah, I, not. That's the best player that LeBron's ever had on his team. The Lakers are going. The Lakers are built for prime time right now. No, they're not. They they close. They will be. Give me the guy that has been to the big stage for the last nine years, and I'll be fine. And then give me the we had fifth him last best year. player in the league. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> we I'll had him it. last year. And then he said, whoa, these niggas are bums. I'm taking a break. Load management. And no, he tried to get AD over there, and then once he couldn't, he threw a fit, and then everybody else in the locker room was like, fuck you, you just tried to trade us. That's uh, what happened. Still. <laughs> same story. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's a start. It's a start. Come on, give me – is there anything else that you want to break down uh, uh, from – the NBA or from the draft or from your team or just anything that you want to give us? Um, I hope Kyrie doesn't come to the Lakers. I'll just say that. I don't want to see that again. Uh, again, was he on the Lakers before? Well, LeBron and Kyrie. Got it, I don't, don't want to see it. that again. Worked out well last time. Once. It worked out. Um, I think Kawhi is going to the Clippers. He don't want to see it work out on his team. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to work out. I don't want to, uh, Kawhi to the Clippers. I would like to see that. I think the Clippers become a very, very big contender. You've been in the a Clippers West. fan for a long time in the yeah. low. No, 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 I don't I'm think not Kawhi leaving. Uh, I don't think Kawhi leaving. I don't think either. I, I think, think he's going to stay for a short, like a little one. Nah, I don't think, think he's leaving. For some, the, if, the if he was leaving, I'll tell you one thing. He's sure making his rounds at all the local <laughs> restaurants and ball games. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you was going to leave, you sure making your well, the, well, <laughs> dance felt in the city. It's a nice city. Aside from other things, I think he's leaving. If you just listen to his his speech at the parade. Yeah, it sounded like he, I got it. Yeah, he said, uh, "Enjoy this, enjoy the moment." That sounds like it'll never happen again because I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it sounded like to me. Statue of Kawhi in front of that place. If he uh, stays there, they they wouldn't chip. It, you know why it wouldn't surprise me? Only because the fact that he left San Antonio, he left Pop. No player ever leaves Popovich, right? So when he did that, now to me, nothing he does is surprising. So yeah, if you can leave Popovich, you can leave the Raptors. Yeah, That's just how I look. There's one though. He should stay for another year. I mean, but he won in San Antonio. True. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I would stay in Toronto if I was him. Right. I would but, stay you in know, San Antonio. He's a Cali kid. He wants to be the warm weather and shit like that. I can, I understand. I never understood that, but when players are like, oh, it's too cold, fam, you're literally there for like three, yeah. four months, and right. then you it's vacation time. You can go wherever the fuck you want to go in the world. $100 million. Yeah, like, <laughs> how, the fuck does that mean? Put a jacket on. 
<laughs> That's fair And Kawhi ain't hanging out In the streets anyway Like he ain't going to the clubs <laughs> He going to the arena And back home Like how yeah. cold can it be When you go downstairs And get in the SUV Yeah When, when your SUV is parked In yeah, the building already Yeah and they already. drive you to Inside <laughs> you the tunnel a, You don't need a jacket Yeah they drive you In the locker room Like yeah. what cold you feeling But I get it I wouldn't leave Toronto though Great city And congrats to them I don't know if I Said that on yeah, I don't know if we. We just left Toronto. Shut up, nigga. Yeah, great city, beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, mean it's I a great city. Leave. You and Worry just left. Yeah, I think. We, well, I, I, was, I, I was mad. I had to leave. Six yeah, boys. I was mad about that. <laughs> huh? Who's the real Sixers, y'all? <laughs> Me and Maul are not the Sixers. Yes, y'all are. We're not the Sixers. Yes, not the Sixers <laughs> yes, y'all are. No, we're not. Yeah, y'all Rory's are. only like five eleven. <laughs> I'm not five eleven. I'm five nine on a great day. Rory, Rory went to Toronto to catch the EO show, and then came to New York to catch the EO show. He yeah. manages EO. <laughs> He's also a sixer. You uh, you just went. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Fuck it. Well, <laughs> yeah. this nigga just said, you know what? I mean, <laughs> going to Toronto. I was like, oh shit. But you, you know can't why? be mad at yo. I'm going to Toronto. But that's can never be only mad because at I don't do shit at home. I don't do much. Yeah, like that's I don't right. go out. I don't do shit. So it's like fuck it. Weekend. I'm out. Toronto. Hey, hey, Toronto. Man. May through September is now. always a yo. I'm I'm going to Toronto. I'm never mad at that movie. Hey, hold yeah. up. Hold up, Roy. Hey, Maul. Mm. Now that I'm single too, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, shut First up. First of all, he, Toronto is more than just did, women, Joe. No, I get it. No. Joe relate everything. <laughs> like now that he's single, oh, I get it. No, that's not nah, it, Joe. Nah, I know what I don't do much be now. I don't go nowhere, bro. <laughs> I don't I go chill nowhere. In the hotel. I don't go anywhere. Course. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, I don't go yeah, anywhere. Man. I don't hang out. It's, huh? it's the same reason I hit the little Insta Live with a jam session every day. You know what I mean? Hey, let's Check jam. Check the temperature. Let's jam, y'all. I'm home. <laughs> Just let them know that you're hey, home. I'm I'm home. I see what Joe. Nah, I'm nah, home man. alone. I'm home alone. <laughs> sad. Nah, man. Nah. Just listening and Wait, so your, your jam session is like your bat signal? <laughs> That's definitely Joe bat signal. To let somebody know to pull up, yeah, to pull up look, is okay. at the, look at the good music yeah, and come through. And vibes. Look at all this vibes. <laughs> look at all this Anita Baker. Yeah. Anita Baker and candles. Who's going to oh, say yeah. no to Anita they Baker? They can't be and intimidating candles. over there. Ew. They're playing the Isley Ed Brothers. <laughs> look at all of this Anita Baker that I have over here. Anita Baker and candles. Who's not coming? Yo, you, you know, you know. What's and funny? Joe be like, he be trying to pretend like yeah, he's talking to the chef or some shit. Like, you're not charred. I want it charred. It's charred. <laughs> <laughs> Seared. <laughs> Nah, I don't, I don't do that, but Rory, Rory, Rory write a little bit. Sometimes the chick be like, we, um, let's go out. I was like, all right, hit the driver. Hit the driver. <laughs> you, right, sometimes you got to let them know. Hit the driver. Oh, you don't drive? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's wrong with girls, man? No, come on. Nah, I'm going to use that. Rory can't use... talk about what's wrong with girls. Hit the driver is first literally of all, First of all, I can hit the Uber and say the yeah. exact same thing. Word. Yo, let me hit the driver. <laughs> That's all semantics. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, you're not saying get That's an true. Uber. That's I'm true. saying right, let me hit the I'm driver. getting the driver. Oh, you don't drive. Yeah. Oh, what, what car you drive? I'll know when I hit, hit send. Probably I mean, a Honda Accord. But yeah. you know. I mean, yeah. I mean, what's today? Yeah, she's usually <laughs> got, got to see when he pull up. I don't know. I tell, I, I tell him surprise me. Yeah, pull it out the lot. Yo, all right. I'm Yo, if you do, right. if you do surprise me and you show up in a Civic, <laughs> surprise. That's a surprise. That it is. Uh, all right. Uh, I think I, somehow I think that we have covered everything that I yeah. am willing to cover for today. I have yeah. more, <laughs> but uh, now, double XL freshman. I'm cool. I don't care. Same shit. <laughs> I'm cool. Uh, push and in Lauren man, leak they, was good. Huh? The push in Lauren leak. I didn't hear. It. I didn't hear. It. It's good. Cool. Hey, I think you both would like it. Hey, I, well, I'm sure. I'm I sure. Would. I'm sure I would. Hey, try to sneak the double XL cover out there when they thought we might care. We don't. <laughs> no, no, nigga. Just show us Meg and. <laughs> It was good pictures. Uh, and I'm talking shit, but I, I, I didn't really examine the cover. I don't know how many people uh, on there I know. I don't know who's deserving. I don't know who's not. I'm just talking shit. I will say this is the first year in a long time that I, I actually knew like a couple on there. Yeah, me too. I was kind of proud of myself. Yeah. I saw Meg the Stallion on there. I said, oh, you got it right. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Lil Nas? All right, bet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, word. The yeah, Roddy Rich. There. Roddy the Rich is on there. Roddy Rich is, uh, to me, one of the... Uh, He's, I think he's gonna be a big star. I'm with you more. I feel like Roddy Rich. I, I listen to his music and the way that he like he writes his hooks and shit like that. Like mm. he's he's talented. I, I didn't know he more. was. I didn't know he was was that dope until I really started listening to his shit. I like him a lot. I got a hip up. 
I didn't hear uh, I didn't hear this Lil Nas X project, but he sure duped all of us. I, I did go peek to what ca- how they would categorize it. It's alternative. It is not country. There's like a, two rock songs on there. There's one that's his album. Of, yeah. Oh, okay. It's it's an alter- there's no country songs. Besides. It's, it's an alternative <laughs> album. He says. Yeah. Or someone says. Someone I says. I don't know if it's him. Yeah. Who determines what your album is? Like the genre, the label. Columbia. The A and R. So they sit down and listen the, to the, it, and they the say al- the algorithms. <laughs> so they sit down and say, "Okay, this is." They sit down and look at the algorithms and say, "This is alternative. This, let's this put is this you. here. Yeah, this put, will clean up here. Put you over. Part. Put yeah. you over here, nigger boy. <laughs> Got you. Alternative. Yeah. Got you. Or or if they're trying to do the the rebrand of like this is your musician album, you're right. gonna go from R and B to alternative. Right. Like whoa, <laughs> whoa, Miguel, not R and B this time. <laughs> that's what they'll do. No, you said Miguel. That's what they. That's what Bird keep trying to do with Tanaje. <laughs> <laughs> keep trying to change a category. We, I, it's her still. I can. I, I, I can see her. <laughs> I, I can see her. <laughs> yeah. Joe's an idiot, man. What? It's, it's, it's what? her it's still. Her. I can see her. No, no, they put a different vest on her. No, nah, and it's fucked up because y'all are stupid. I think Tanaje put a song out uh, like last week or something. I thought it was kind of cool. I was like fuck. I like that. What's her name? Danny Lay. Yeah, I like her. Oh, I like you should talk. You dicky. <laughs> I was gonna say something but Mikey canceled so <laughs> Let me not I know what you was about to say Why don't, why don't but... we not even say that? <laughs> <laughs> no, we can say that No, we're not ever losing that We don't have to say it No, it's not As true. long as you don't say What you was gonna say You can say I'm not gonna say What I was gonna say If Park says the N-word Right now And I think nigger It's the same thing No No, no that's different From what I'm doing though Let's be safe though <laughs> What you mean? Let's take it out. <laughs> I didn't soft. say nothing. I know, but when you say I was going to say something, and now two million people try to think of what you were going nah, to say. Nah, fuck that. that, that no, I don't get nah. Get I'm the fuck out all this time. Get yeah, the fuck out of here. You know I'm. That get is, the that fuck out of here. How these days. Yeah, fuck communication that. works though. Get the fuck out of here. If I say Vaughn gave us a thumbs up. Get the fuck out of here, man. You crazy as fuck. Was just with his seizure brother. His seizure brother in Miami. He don't have no good sex right now. His seizure brother. He was that so, wasn't a seizure. He was yeah. so proud of him. Yo, that's my family. I was like, why are you claiming that? <laughs> I don't claim my brother. All right. <laughs> Look, the guy foaming at the mouth. Yeah, word. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't see Savon in, in my mix. Like, I was in Miami, too, and Parks kept t- trying to hit me to hang out. I was like, Parks, we would, but no, nah, you would Savon. <laughs> <laughs> like, I said, to Ryan, I said to Brandon, I said, I said, yo, Parks hit me, said he's over there at the tavern. He's like, yo. Savon's there, too. I was like, nope. <laughs> No, you would, I'm yo, that, never. Save on me, and you will never hang out. That unless DJ we're was fucking killing I've, I've seen you. enough I've, from I've you. I've taken you to the tavern. Yeah, I we went together after. Bam, uh, I'm I was taking him at mad time. I, yeah. I love the tavern. I'm not going there <laughs> if Savon is there. <laughs> Y'all got. I'm not partying with Savon. <laughs> Why? Because I've seen Savon at he work. Was he was chilling. <laughs> I've seen him at work. <laughs> You think I would want to go to a and you said when it's seizure? No, 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 no. Sorry, sorry. I'll catch the tavern when it's me and Parks and Brandon. <laughs> they was playing guy, some good music. Some of the boy. homies. That DJ was killing it. Well, that's why the seizure happened. He played for f- five and a half hours. Wait, that happened at Wood Tavern. That, that's that's no, why. I was about to say. That's why he hit the floor. It's like, oh, let me start foaming. <laughs> I know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> Videotape it. Oh man, come on! What are we doing? Uh, it's the Saturday podcast. So what we got to play old songs, right? I forgot. Oh, yeah, I forgot right. how to pod. I don't know. <laughs> what do we normally do? That's how it goes. That's how it goes. Uh, I want to end this by saying, let me let's hit the round of applause for uh, Fifty Cent Curtis Jackson, who is supposed to be getting his Hollywood Walk of Fame star in 2020. Good for him. Oh, congrats. Uh, him, him along with um, Alicia Keys, okay. uh, Spike Lee. Damn, Spike. Uh, oh, Wendy man. Williams. That's crazy. Um, so yeah, round of applause for them. Huge accomplishment. Uh, y'all already know how I feel about uh, 50s Journey. It's, it's my favorite journey ever mm. in hip hop. So for uh, for Hollywood to acknowledge it, yeah, I'm happy about that. I'm happy about that. I also want to shout out my baby boy, my my oldest, my oldest. Trey, who graduated from high school, uh, I want to shout out to him. Congrats, Trey! Yeah, man, yes, super, sir. super, super, super proud of my of my baby boy. Had his lady behind him, looked good, cap and gown. Went out to party later, got into some hooligan shit. Uh, man, I'm feeling my up, guy. <laughs> feeling my guy. Turn man. up. Hey, we gonna buy? I'm giving you a car, man. I'm gonna get, <laughs> <laughs> I ain't get my car, man. You you can't fuck on a bus. <laughs> 
I mean, I mean, it, it, it builds happen. It builds character. It builds I mean, character. Uh, yeah. You gotta go through that. It, it builds yeah. character. Yeah, give him a year. Wait yeah, till you're yeah, 19. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> builds yeah. character. Go Let through. him figure out how to fuck in the park. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's an important discovery. Hell absolutely. Yeah. For a kid. But it's fucked up because now I think like it's like real jail time for it. Oh, shit. <laughs> Back in the day, we could sneak and. Yeah. yeah, get a ticket. Yeah, just get that. chased out the park. What was that? The truant, truancy <laughs> <laughs> police. Oh my! Yeah. Wait a we old. They, they don't have around. that no more, right? Shit, yes they do. For real? Yeah. What do they do now? Lock niggas up. What you mean? <laughs> <laughs> but kids ain't even kidding like that. Like Nick, Nick we was wild, and these kids is on Fortnite and <laughs> like, nah, no, they ain't. <laughs> no, no, nah, they got they still running around. Hell no. Yeah, shit. We got hammers, machetes, all types of shit. Come up to I, I, I was told no. <laughs> Y'all, your niggas laugh at me when I be like I'm staying home, but I'm yeah. alive. Yeah. <laughs> I'm young safe. boys wilding uptown. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not gonna go uptown. Um, damn, I was about to say something, but I don't remember now. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> All right, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Feels really, 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 really good to be back. Thank you all for your patience. Thank you for your understanding. Uh, thank you all for rocking with us for. Four years and counting. Thank you for just thank you for all of it, man. Thank you for it's because of y'all that we needed a break. Okay. Really? If it, listen, if it wasn't no fans, we'd have broke a lot sooner. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> we, 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 yeah. Listen, if it wasn't no fans, Rory would be in L.A. still. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> like yeah, yeah, a lot of not free getting time. right back on a seven a.m. flight to go back there. Yeah, or like <laughs> came here for a few hours. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. um yeah, shout out to Rory for being here. Uh, <laughs> uh, so that's about it, man. Keep us oh, in your cheap either. <laughs> yeah. I'm Anyways, sure. you continue. got it though. No, I don't. <laughs> Let's talk about how you got it for a little bit. Nah, <laughs> Before we go, right? No, my, my money is invested uh, elsewhere. Parks went out and brought a uh, fucking charcoal grill. You damn right. Uh, the fourth is coming, buddy. July. <laughs> you know it. Get ready. Ready, yeah. you ready Parks. Get ready Absolutely. For Parks crib. <laughs> Hell yeah! Get ready for Parks Crib. <laughs> I'm coming. I don't give a fuck. Get your, get, your, get your fits ready. Yeah, I'm coming. <laughs> get the your knee fits high, ready. Levi. The peep, peep wide. You see why I need Levi's? <laughs> peep why the Levi's is knee high. <laughs> Not a peep. <laughs> uh, knee high Levi's. Listen, man. Uh, uh, what's my little saying? I still, uh, I still got that list for whenever. We, we're this. short of content of just horrible rap lyrics. It's sitting right in my phone. So this is one we're not going to do. It's just when we don't have content. They think that every time we say that, that we never actually come around to Yeah, that but I actually, I actually and, have it in my phone. And let me let you fans know, every last topic that we have ever said, hey, we got to talk about this one day, Savon assures me he has it written down somewhere yeah, or, right. or his bro seizure brother. Someone wrote no, it. No, he lost it in the seizure. <laughs> this, oh, my God. Jesus. When he was having a seizure, his phone shook and it deleted <laughs> uh, what what is my little line that I uh, so, uh, wow it's been that long for I'm that's crazy you rusty what was the last time you had to just remember freestyle something bro yo yo uh, <laughs> no <laughs> life, life is just a series of moments <laughs> and moments yo, that have come to pass yo, do that. I gave so let's live each the moment the guy, as nah. if it's our nah, last let me do my own bar I'll do that I'm just saying in case you forgot it's over y'all y'all have a good week man I gave everybody we'll bars. I can't do my nah, own. Nah, nah, uh, uh, we'll, uh, nah. We'll see y'all on Wednesday. <laughs> Yo, that's why I'm corny. Yo, why niggas used to go, why the stadium used to go crazy when Jay did that? <laughs> oh, niggas, oh, show about the stars. I, I was one of them. Shut the fuck up, I was nigga. one of them. Oh, you was one of them? <laughs> what? Rory's when it was so just corny. when it was just dust and that came on, dust, <laughs> smoke, whatever that shit was. Listen, that's what it's called. Joe's wild. Listen, Hove, Hove, Hove made that. Uh. -uh. Sound like something monumental was coming. Yeah, same record. Well, just because all right, the rest of us were in the crowd, just because you was backstage. And I was doing, in the crowd too. I was just like a young kid. No, nah, like, oh my god, the other game. I was in the crowd. I was in the crowd for that fade to black show. You had to be. No, you know I had enough of this shit, man. Yo. Ooh. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. 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 You could definitely have some uhs on this one. Uh. Y'all know me, it's Joey. I keep it low key. Oh. <laughs> The old yeah, me? Nah. Are you about to give him the old nah, me? Nah, I was going, I was going in the OD. I was about Ooh. to OD or something. 
you wasn't yo, gonna life, do shit. Nigga, life is a series. Life is a series of moments. I'm doing it. We're not doing that. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. Life is a series of moments. And moments that pass. pass. So, so let's, let's make, make this, this one moment last. last. And this fits our, our last. <laughs> and I have gas. For that ass. Y'all are funny. Having gas for that ass is gross. Remember, do it for reflection, not for perception. Also, also remember, remember that bitch ain't fine. She's just, just young. young. <laughs> <laughs> but I was like, all right, my bad. Go ahead. I'm letting you go. I'm not saying. You're not that. letting me go. Uh, until the next time. So long. Goodbye. Farewell. Adios. Arriva Dirty. Uh, oodles and noodles. Peace. <laughs> Peace. Game the ramen pack. We, we out of here, man. I'm, I'm home getting busy with the ramen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going ham on the ramen at home. Uh, we'll holler, man. We'll talk to y'all. Damn, we right back in a couple days. I yeah. can't complain about it because we all on vacation, <laughs> right? See you yes, a little sir. bit. What? <laughs>